Hello. Hello, hello, hello. What's good? How y'all doing? Beep, boop, 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 beep. Oh, my neck. Okay. Woo! Hello. Oh my God. Bro, right before, I was like chilling all day energy wise. And then, right, I swear to God, I'm not even kidding. Like 15 minutes before I had to start the stream, I just got hit with this wave of fucking fatigue. So I'm trying to fight. I'm trying to fight through it. Normally, it only lasts for like an hour. But. Ooh. We'll see. Yui, thanks for the membership. Tired lesbian. Thanks for the membership. Okay, that name is a mood and a half, bro. That's crazy. I'm not lesbian, but like the tired part, bro, I feel you. <laughs> um, Plum, thanks for the five gifted. Danny, yo, thank you for the 10 gifted. Thank you, thank you. If you got gifted, make sure you say thank you. Of course, of course. Thank you guys so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. Thank you, Danny. I hope you've been well. Hope you've been well, man. What do you mean? You don't like girls? Well, you have to be a girl to be considered a lesbian. Stupid. Okay, trying to trying to twist my words. Huh? Boop, boop, boop. Miss Ka, thanks for the three months. Um, arm, armchair, armchair eagle. Thanks for the six months. Six months already. I'm happy to be here. I hope you have a nice day. Well, thank you. I've been having an okay day. Just been doing some. What the fuck did I do today? My day was like productive, but I don't remember what I did. I did shit though. I oh, don't know. People likes the 50 months. Damn, 50 months is a long ass time. Thank you so much. Vaneko, thanks for the 10 months. Zayla, thanks for the two. Thank you, thank you. Naomi, thanks for the six. Thank you for your streams, Kyo. And thank you for coming to the gifted. Shout out to the gifters. Ori, thanks for the 13 months. And Gabby loves you. Thanks for the membership. Thank you, thank you. Thank you guys so much. Um, And Ghost of Pomu, thanks for the super chat. Boop, 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 boop. Happy Thanksgiving from Canada, y'all. I'm grateful for being a part of the whole Kill Me community and to Kill for being a genuine uh, homie energy live. I can enjoy watching after a long day of work. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Glad you like the content. It means a lot to me. I try my best, you know. So, yeah, I appreciate it. Mazu, thanks for the super chat. Hi, Kill. It's my birthday today. I want to ask if I can get a happy birthday from you. Um, well, happy birthday, Mazu. Happy birthday. I hope you have a good one. Happy, happy birthday. I hope you guys had a good Thanksgiving. If you celebrate, if not, um, I hope your day was just good yesterday. Well, yesterday was it was it was it was fun. It was fun. I didn't really eat much of the Thanksgiving food, but you know, we had chocolate fondue afterward, and you best believe I was fucking that shit up. Okay. I I ate some of that. I ate some of that. Sheesh. Um, Danny, thanks for 20 gifted. Yo, 20 more. Thank you so much, man. Thank you, thank you. If you got gifted, make sure you say thank you as well. Thank you, Danny. Ashton plays thanks for the 15 months. Damn, 15 months is a long ass time, bro. Oh my god, it's been 15 months. What the fuck? Cranberry, thanks for the 15 months as well. Ayana, thanks for the membership. Charlie, thanks for the super. I can't relate to the party, but I'm a random Scarling who came in here before and you were really nice and understanding when I told you about the neurological thing with my eye. So I'm glad you're back. Well, thank you. Thanks for the support. Um, I appreciate it. And yeah, I hope your, your eye shit gets sorted, bro. That shit's ass. Eye pain is terrible. I don't know how to explain it, man. That shit's like something different, bro. I mean, I have it chronically, but like it's just... It's like the one of the worst parts of it. You know, feeling like your eyes are like, about to like explode out your fucking head. Jesus Christ. Um, and Peter Pablo, thanks to Super Chat. Congrats on 420 followers. Wait, did I have 420 subscribers? Oh my God. Okay, I, I need a tweet. I 
and I need, I need, I need, I need to make the obligatory ha 420 tweet Lamau. You know. Hold on. Ha Lamau. 420 lol. Okay, it's done. We did it. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, Blue Mister, thanks to Amuts. Hello, how's your Thanksgiving? It was good. Like I said, I didn't eat much, but I was fucking up the fondue afterward, bro. I was fucking up the fondue, man. We had chocolate fondue, and my mom bought stuff to dip in it, and bro, I was dipping shit in it like crazy. Pink. Thanks for six months. That was like a, the slowest, most unsettling burp I've ever had. Um, um, it's Black Friday and I'm sitting here eating mac and cheese and not shopping. Oh yeah, I forgot. It's Black Friday. Shit's on sale. Lamau. <laughs> don't fuck the fondue. What the fuck? Yeah, Yo, you've been here for over a year and you don't know what I mean when I said I was fucking up something, bro. Come on. You just misinterpreted my words on purpose. Stop it. Get some help. Sales are fake. Loki, I didn't I never I've never participated in Black Friday a day in my life. Not once. Not once. Uh Ethan, thanks for the one month. Thank you. Thank you. Cho Conico Skittles. <laughs> it's a membership. Hi, Kel. I'm glad you're back. I've seen way too many weird searches from the Kelmys. Not as instant as I thought, I guess. Low-key, like, y'all were tamer than I expected. I'm not gonna lie. I was expecting worse. Like, the confession streams, like, they got me... I'm jaded, bro. The confession streams got me fucked up. Um, thanks for the 420 donation. Thank you. They're filtered. The confession stream were anonymous. Oh, you're right. I forgot about that shit. Yeah, that does make y'all. That does make y'all motherfuckers go a bit more crazy. Y'all on Twitter, especially the ones who are like, you know, the fucking community based people that like other people in the community like follow each other. They're like too embarrassed to expose themselves. I see y'all. Gotta uphold a reputation or some shit. Bro, go like the membership. One month. Um, happy to be a. God damn, my, 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 my. Hello, can I speak? One month. Happy to meet you and be a part of the community. Well, thank you. Glad to have you here as well. And Danny, yo, thank you for the massive donation. What the fuck? Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it, bro. You always are way too generous, bro. Thank you so much. I'm busy and stressed, but always got time to watch your stream, man. Can't wait for today's stream. Glad you ate good yesterday. Thank you. Uh, hopefully, you're less stressed and less busy soon. You can catch a fucking break, you know? Everyone needs a break on occasion. Um, Brianna, thanks for two months. Thank you for creating content that I uh, love to rewatch and bring pockets of joy to my day. Well, thank you. All right. Shuya Minos, your Oshi. I can't read your name because it's not in English. Thank you for the three months. Exciting to see the weird, creepy search history. By the way, my name is pronounced Banana. Oh my God, you told me. See, I thank you, Banana. Shout out to you because I would have had no fucking idea. See, thank you. Thanks, Banana, for the three months. You do this every time. Banana, put it at the beginning of your message. You always put it at the end, okay? I swear every time I say I don't know your name and then at the end, it's like, my name is Banana, by the way. Yo, put it, put it at the beginning just in parentheses and then I'll know. You know, unless you want to troll me and put it at the end, you know, I mean, that's cool, too. Thanks, banana. <laughs> Wonton, yo, thank you for the five gifted. Thank you. Thank you. Man. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, And Charlie, thanks for the super chat. Finally seeing a specialist soon. Uh, Just a little over a month left. We'll see if I can get this eye patch off without having double vision. Fingers crossed. 
yeah bro hopefully hopefully it works i remember one time i had to get like an eye exam for some shit oh my god bro i was there for five hours okay like doing the exam stuff for five hours like it wasn't on some like oh i was waiting no no no, no. like i was in in getting tested for like five hours straight and after the fucking eye exam i dead ass could not see like i actually thought i was blind and i was like paranoid but like i was my vision was not gonna return i remember that it was crazy they like did so much shit to my eyes like they I, my eyes got like fucked up for the rest of the like for like the next two days it was crazy maybe they need to do some thorough shit like that to you it was not a fun time though i'll, I'll be honest uh hi neko thanks for the super chat happy thanksgiving day and have a good stream kill thank you peter pablo thanks for the super chat i'm gonna stay here where it's safe from black friday bro yeah i don't know every year i feel like like after black friday like the next morning on the news there's like all this news coverage of like people like fighting each other over like fucking like two dollar tvs and shit or like there's like like oh my god there was a fight in uh in this tech store over this cheap television da -da -da. you know like i swear tomorrow morning bro the news is just gonna be some videos okay you thought the waffle house fight videos were crazy look at the black friday fight videos those are even crazier I'm gonna just, I'm gonna be a Cyber Monday person. You know, I'm gonna chill and, you know, buy cheap shit online. Exit, thanks for super chat. When's the cover gonna drop? How much do I have to give? Um, guys, please don't put pressure on me, man. The more pressure you put, the more I think you guys have expectations, and then the less I wanna do it because uh, I'm worried I'm not gonna meet them. You know? I'm gonna be honest with you. So if you really want it to happen, you know, just sh sh shut up about it. All right? Don't hype it up too much. Um, Rosie, thanks for super chat. Hi, Kyo, it's my birthday today. Well, happy fucking birthday. Damn, we got two birthdays. Happy birthday. Exits, thanks for the gifted as well. Um, Ryoshi Yagiri, thanks for the 15 months. Damn, 15. Bro, 15 months. I can't believe it. So fucking long. Oh my God, I pulled a T-Pain real quick. Okay. Boop, boop. <laughs> Uh, Marianne, thanks so much for the membership as well. Thank you, thank you. Don't worry, we are monks when it comes to patience. No the fuck y'all aren't, bro. I take a week off and Twitter, like, y'all are on Twitter, like, crying like I died, okay? Y'all, you lie as easily as you breathe, okay? The patience is not patiencing. Literally, I talked about this thing on, on a Twitch stream the other day, and it's the cover thing. And literally... It wasn't like I had like like as many viewers as I normally have on YouTube, right? But there were still so many clips and like copium posts on Twitter about it, okay? Like literally, y'all are not patient. Don't lie to me, okay? Don't lie to me. Y'all on Twitter like making edits of this shit like it's a copium. I hope he does it, <laughs> you know? Stop it. What are you talking about? Don't worry about it. Because it's probably not going to happen. So if I tell you, you're going to be more disappointed that it's not happening than if I just didn't say anything. So it's not happening. Or like 99, 90, 95% not happening. If it happens, there'll be like a 5% and like I will suddenly have like gotten struck with like immense inspiration and like, you know, joy. I think this is just your imaginations. What do you mean? I saw it this morning. Uh, Valley, this is three months. Hi, Kyo. Thank you for all the content. Everyone's looking forward to everyone's browser history. And thank you for the gifters. Thank you, gifters, for the three months. Boop, 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 boop. The gaslighting. Yo, I'm not gaslighting at all. Yo, I'm being very honest, okay? I'm like, don't get your hopes up, you know? Realistically, I'm like, I'm telling you to like spare your feelings, you know? Because if you expect something and it doesn't happen, you're going to be more disappointed than if you didn't expect something and it happens. See, think about it like that. If you're expecting this like crazy thing to happen, you're going to be like, uh, well, uh, I'm sad it didn't happen. But if I never, if you don't expect it and then it drops, you're going to be like, damn. We're fed, you know? Opium emote when? We, we have one. We, we literally have one.
My dog is a Kyomu. Do you have something to say to him? Um. What up, bitch? Wait, is it a female dog? Shit, my bad. Uh, what up, uh, uh, Rover? <laughs> what? Are, what's the male equivalent of a bitch? And the dog. What do you call it? Male dog? What's What's the term for that? Wait, I'm gonna Google this. Term for male dog. Oh, it's just a dog. Damn. Damn. That's crazy. The male dog is just dog and the female dog is just bitch. Damn, bro. The, 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 I can't believe, I can't believe dogs are upholding the patriarchy. That is so fucked up. <laughs> the female ones are the only one with a derogatory name. That's crazy. The sexism goes crazy. Yeah, what the fuck? I I can't believe this. It's a he and he just growled at you. Well, shit. I'm glad they they can growl. That means they're healthy, right? I don't fucking know. Am I okay? Probably not. Alright. So chat. Today. 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 What we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be looking at y'all's search history okay the deranged stuff that you look for on your computer you type with your little crummy ass fingers you google this shit in your private spare time okay you know the the history of um of all your potential degeneracy the websites you access you know maybe we'll find out you know a few a tag or two that you're into maybe we'll find out you know what you like to do as a hobby or maybe we'll find out that you're a studious student googling um you know research information because you have a paper due in um three hours let's see a real spice won't be incognito search history but like i can't Incognito doesn't record the search history. So, like, that's not really possible. If it was... Oh, best believe. Best believe. I would look at that. Are we gonna need holy water? Ah! Ah! Allegedly. I don't, I don't know. Maybe. Possibly. You know, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not too sure. Okay, so... Let's take it from the top. I gathered about 60 of them. I'm not sure how many we're going to get through because I do have a stream that's like a collab after this. Um, I'm going to be streaming that on Twitch. But um, yeah, it's with like, you know, Shoto, Girl DM, Nia Chu, and Five Up. We're going to be playing League of Legends. Anyways, we got 63. The first one. The first search history, I think, you know, let's look at this. Okay, we got, what's a job called when you host a voice for a baseball or football game? Okay, it's just a, a hoster or announcer. Barnes and Noble, okay, you read. I don't even know what the fuck that next one is. Mimic, chapter two, maze, idle lyrics. How many volumes, September birthday. I can put you in my ripped jeans. And are you smarter than a fifth grader quiz? Okay, this just kind of looks like... Um, I think you're a gamer, you know, maybe you play Genshin and I also think you're a little bit of a weeb, you know, you like the animus, you know, you're into that sort of stuff. Okay. I don't know. Maybe something a little freaky deaky because I can put you in my ripped jeans. That's a little bit wild personally. You know, I don't know, man. I can put you in my ripped jeans. Sounds a little bit. A little bit inter interesting, okay? And you like to read. Um, You know, I don't know what you like to read, but you like to read, I guess. You, you Barnes and Noble shit. And on occasion, you have, you know, some some random question that you Google, like, you know, what's it called when you host it? I think this is pretty normal, you know? I feel like if we had an average search history of every single one of my viewers, this would be like that. This is like the averaged out one. Like, it's not too crazy. It's not too boring. It's like, it's a good balance of like normal, you know? I don't really think it's crazy. I don't think it's crazy. Um, 
apparently there's some bl novel in this shit too you know shout out to that i guess you know i still think that would fit in the the average um so i, I you know i don't think this is that bad you know this is pretty normal you know I'm, i don't know not the npc search no this isn't an npc search bro no stop stop why you why y'all cooking chat why you cooking this person bro they're they're the most no they're probably one of the more healthy ones okay look at your search history huh I guarantee you're just a little bit, a little bit more, a little bit more suspect. All right, next one we got. Um, okay, so we have days, and they said, "How long is Blaklava good for?" I don't know. I've heard that before. Actually. Is that a food? I've heard that before. I don't know exactly what it is. I low key think it might. Is it a food? Am I crazy? Boop, boop. Sorry, I'm turning on my alarms. The dessert. Mmm. Okay, I think I feel like I've heard of that before. Okay, how many times has something been possessed? Um, what's the same song? Why has the same song been stuck in my head for a year? Okay. Why is there a player limit in pro, pro layer limit haircutting? Okay, so uh, I feel like okay. Listen, if I had to get a profile on the type of person you were. I think you're either into haircutting or like you're studying haircutting, okay? Or like you're trying to like, you know, you're 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 definitely you're definitely like trying to be like a cosmetologist or you just are trying to cut your own hair to save some money so you're looking up YouTube tutorials, all right? And then on top of that, um Okay, I'm not going to lie. I just find it funny when people search stuff that it's like realistically like the answer you're gonna get is not gonna help you at all. Like, okay, listen. Listen, 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 listen. listen. Oh, actually, maybe they're artists looking for references. Yeah, because they they do they use procreate. Wait, shit, you're right, chat. Y'all are smart. Okay, no. But I find it funny how they're like, why has the same song been stuck in my head for a year? <laughs> like, bro, you think Google's gonna have the answer to that? You think Google's gonna be like well, um, scientifically, here's what happens. And this is how you forget it. No, no, Google's not going to help you with that, okay? And I love how that's like the most random one. Like everything else has has like a natural progression of like, okay, haircutting, okay, limits. Okay, you know, something, something. And then we suddenly have like, uh, why is the same so song been stuck in my head for a year? And then we just go back to something else. It's like the most out of place one. And realistically, like Googling this does not help you, Okay. Like, bro, Google, listen, guys, listen, Google is a good resource, but sometimes, you know, you just, it, it's not, it doesn't, you know, it's not going to solve everything. Okay. You know, I am curious though, what song was stuck in your head? All right. Next one. I'm so ashamed. Please don't judge me. How else is everyone's history so normal? Okay. If this is not normal, I'm, if this is normal, I'm going to be like pissed. Oh, no, this is not normal. What? Oh, 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 oh. Never mind. I was like, this is normal, but never mind. Okay, we got. I don't even know who. Mangago. Is Mangago a Genshin character? I just feel like every time I don't know a name, it's a Genshin character. I'm not going to lie. I just feel like that is a common thing. You know, what is Mangago? Chat, can someone inform me? Is it a Genshin character? Is it a Genshin character? Yeah. It's always a Genshin character, isn't it, bro? No? It's a manga website. Oh. Okay, well, so they've been on this manga website and they looking up um kidnap the tags they're looking up are kidnaps. Okay, AO3 head shave. What the fuck is a head shave? Do I want to know what a head shave is? What the? F head shave. Manga. Head, head shave. Fan fiction. What is head shave? Tag head shave. Head shave fan fiction definition. What?
Okay, I can't find any answers, bro. I'm looking and I can't find shit. I can't find shit. You know, I got saved. I don't know what head shave means. So, you know, maybe um we're safe for now. Um, I couldn't find shit. You know, but whatever. Okay, then we got tentacle. Okay, I mean, you know what? Out of all the tags you have, tentacle's probably the most normal one. You know, I ain't even gonna lie. Then we got haircut. Actually, wait, maybe haircut's the most normal one. Wait, you went to like haircutting fan fictions, hair story network, and Genshin Impact haircut fan fiction. Is cutting hair a fucking thing people are into? They're into haircuts. I'm not gonna lie. Like, okay, listen. <laughs> listen, guys, listen. Realistically, haircutting is not that bad. Like, like of all the things you could be into, I'm gonna be honest. Like, I don't think it's terrible. You know? I don't really think it's that bad. You know, there are definitely worse things that people are into, unless I don't understand what haircutting actually means. But, you know, I don't think, you know, cutting someone's hair is like that bad, you know? As far as I know. Okay, everyone in chat is like, no, please stop. Okay, so is it worse than I thought? Okay, I'm gonna assume it's worse than I thought. Yeah, I mean, if it's just cutting head, um, uh, the, cutting, cutting, pause. <laughs> cutting hair, I don't think it's that bad. Um, I don't know about any, it's more humiliating. Oh. 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 Never, never mind. Okay. Um, my, my fault. My, um, my fault. I misunderstood. Um. Okay. And then, uh, the last, uh, category we have is, um, slave. Um, well, that's the third one of the night. Uh, the next. <laughs> haircut reference is to actual haircutting. Wait. That is still odd. Like, realistically, I don't think that's the worst thing people could be into, though. There's, like, way worse shit, you know? And Plum makes a super chat. Five haircutting terms later yo i think you're into haircutting whoa detective you're scaring us yo i don't know man there's yo terms like haircutting could be like a term for some crazy shit you never know man okay sometimes they got code words and shit all right next one i'm a swedish cosplayer don't judge me too hard okay they got twitter ao3 h&m aliexpress niji sanji okay omnisexual v shoujo spotify stats march 7 cosplay and cyber store clothes. Okay, yeah, you're. This is like the most low key. If I had to look for like a, D, this is kind of like a, like like this is like bordering between like stock image search results and like average demographic that watches VTubers search results. It's like a good mix. Like realistically, if I had to like, it's like it's like you're you're like like you know stock image search results and yeah, it's pretty tame pretty normal you know there's nothing crazy in here i'm not gonna lie this is pretty this is the most tame one i've seen all day god damn it, it, this it's almost like someone was like what are vtuber fans into and then they just like you had to come up with keywords for what they would be into and like this is what it came up with you know like you fucking chat gpt keywords for vtuber fans and this is the list it gave you like i can see that you know it's not crazy Carolina, thanks for the membership. Charlie, what the fuck, man? Peter Powell, thanks for super chat. Reminds me of the hair kind of villain from Courage of the Cowardly Dog that was obsessed with shaving people's hair. That was probably their inspiration. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. I can't get over that. That's the thing. I, yo, I, I see, I, I learn shit every time I do one of these, man. Like, I didn't know that was a thing people would be into. But I mean, I, I, I mean, I get, you know what I'm saying? I guess you learned. 
All right, next one. There's a bit of variation in the searches. Valorant guns, invasive earthworms. How long does spicy poop let? Huh? Cove Holden. How long can thawed pork stay in the fridge? Diarrhea versus di dihoria. Okay, what the fuck is dihoria? What? Dihoria? Huh? Okay. Meme generator. Fruits to tattoo on. Why is it itchy inside my skin and fish from Shark Tail? Okay, here's my theory, right? This kind of tells a story, okay? Now, the most recent searches are at the top. The l least recent ones are at the bottom. So my thing is, okay, I think they ate some thawed pork that had been in the fridge for too long, right? Okay, because they said how long can thawed pork stay in the fridge? Okay, but they didn't realize it was the thawed pork yet. So they had diarrhea from it. Okay, so then they searched diarrhea versus dihoria because I think they, you know, misspelled it or something. Okay, and then they were like, wait, fuck, I have diarrhea. Maybe it's the pork. So then they Googled how long can thawed pork stay in the fridge? And then they were like, shit, not that long. Then they Googled some random other shit. And then all of a sudden their poop started getting spicy. I don't know what that spicy poop means. Maybe that means it burns a little bit, you know, when the durra comes out. And then they were like, how long is this going to last? Because they were curious, you know, about how long the thawed pork that they ate that was fucking, you know, probably rotten is going to fuck up their poop. And then they found out the answers. And then they just Googled invasive earthworms because I guess they were bored or something. And then they started playing Valorant. You know, I mean, that's my theory. That's my theory. I think that's what happened personally. Um, You know, me, uh, me personally, uh, that uh, that's my theory. I don't care if it's right in my mind. I'm pontificating that this is this is a, a right. Okay, maybe for invasive earthworms, maybe, maybe even instead of earthworms, maybe they thought they had like a tapeworm or something. And that's why their fucking intestines were all fucked up. They're like, damn, bro. You know, you know how humans can sometimes get worms? It's pretty rare, but you can get them that would like fuck up your, your gut and your intestines. So maybe they thought that was one of those and they just didn't know what type of worm it was. So they Googled invasive earthworms because they weren't really too sure. You know, so that might have even been the thing. They like got some fucking worm disease from the, the thawed pork that was in the fridge for too long after having diarrhea. And they're like, ah, oh, invasive earthworms. I wonder if this is it. Boom. If you're eating anything, my, my, I apologize. But you know what? Like at this point, like, I don't know. Plum, thanks for super chat. Did you submit your own to throw us off? No, I showed y'all mine. Low-key, like, my search history is kind of tame. Whoa, 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 whoa. Carolina, thanks for the membership. And Melody, thanks for the membership. Bro made a whole lore from search history. That, yeah, that's, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to figure out what type of person you are. All right, next one. I think I'm pretty normal smiley face. Okay, you got some Ren Kyoto fan art. Uh, Okay. Ah, yo, I'm telling you, this is why I think it's funny, bro. They're literally just searching like random shit. And then out of all of them, there's just literally, there's literally just like, why does my cat pee on my bed? Why does my cat pee on my bed? They're like, like out of everything, everything else is pretty much in the same genre of shit. Okay, everything else is in the same genre. It's like some, you know, we... And then they're like, why does my cat pee on my bed? Like, <laughs> what the fuck, bro? What the fuck? Yo, I don't know nothing about these 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 manga websites, okay? If you know something about it, bro, that, that, that says more about you than it does about me, okay? I have no clue, all right? I have no clue. If you know, that means you're one of the infected. All right, here's plums. Kyo Kaneko, bad ending speed run compilation. Meow, meow, ball. Legal advice for reformed hackers. How to help your bro meet girls when he never leaves his room. Is Scarlett Yonaguni single? Does lack of sleep affect pronunciation? Scientific word for fear of condiments. How to subtly backseat a gamer and can suddenly growing 20 centimeters shrink your brain. Did you fucking type all of these? 
Did you clear your search history and then fucking type all of these and then screenshot it so you could like fucking roast me with your fucking searches? Is that what the fuck you did? Did you <laughs> did you clear your search history and then proceed to write a bunch of random shit about me to fucking like to roast me? Because you said can suddenly growing 20 centimeters shrink your brain. Okay, I grew 20 centimeters. How to subtly backseat a gamer so you can backseat me without me getting mad. Scientific word for fear of condiments. We get it. I eat everything plain. Okay. Is Scarlett on a Goonie single? That's my sister. Fuck off. Okay. Even if she is single, um, she's not available for you, stupid. All right, next one. How to help your bro meet girls whenever he, when he never leaves his room. Thanks, Plum. Thanks. You know, thanks. You know. I, I don't see I don't see you walking around with um you know a boot thing either okay. All right, next one. Legal advice for reformed hackers. Okay, you know I mean I didn't know you were breaking the law. You know me personally, I'm not a hacker. I don't know what you're talking about. Then you added the meow meow shit because you wanted me to say meow meow. Okay, and then you said bad ending speedrun compilation because you know just in case I didn't understand that all of these were were subbing me and dissing me okay just, just in case because you thought i might have been too stupid right to realize that these were all disses to me you had to make the first one have my name in it just to make sure thank you <laughs> yo you put way too much effort into this bro what the fuck you know what i respect it though i really do i do you know what you did a good job you know i you know you did a good job you did the thing you know what shout out to you okay Okay, you know what? Shout, shout out to you, okay? How to subtly backseat a gamer is crazy, though. I'm not going to lie. Like, that's probably, that's probably the most disrespectful search. Because it's like, I know you were, you were dead serious looking that up. Hi, right, thanks for Super Chat. And my humor's messed up, bro. It's okay, bro. Just just chill out. Plum just said yes. Okay, yep. See, I told you. And Charlie, there's a super chat as well. Back off, Scarling ain't gonna date you. Us Scarlings will find you. It's okay, Scarlings, you know. Not gonna date you either, but, you know, it's okay. You know, Guys, listen. No one is allowed, okay? I'll, I will find you. Mm. I'm my sister. All right, next one. Okay. Return on total asset. What's a good return on total asset? Anna Alouette 2.0. What's a good return on assets? Income statement. Return on total asset purpose. Return on total asset example. Google Doc. All right. So you were doing your fucking homework. That's what this is. Okay. You were writing a paper. You were doing your homework. You probably studying like you're either in like a fucking econ class or you're studying finance. You're probably studying finance. Okay. Because I don't, I don't, I don't think, I don't know if you learn about return on total assets in fucking econ. That's more of like an investment banking kind of thing. So, you know, and then randomly you got bored while doing your homework. It's like, oh, let me look at Anna's new outfit. And then, you know, you went back to it. So, yeah. Okay. You're in finance. If you ever work for the IRS, um, give me a break on my taxes, please. You know, I've been trying to save money recently. You know, you know, I'm just saying. Um, thank you. Next one. They just put a standing man emoji. I know this is going to be fucked up. Are potatoes a vegetable? Is potato bad for health? Aster Arcadia PNG. FNAF, how to apologize to someone. How to beat your brother. How to beat your friends. Google Translate. And what does more on the horizon mean? So get this. In chronological order, they searched how to beat your friends. Okay. Then... How to beat your brother. Then afterward, how to apologize to someone. <laughs> so you got in a fight with your brother or your friend or both. And then you're like, fuck, man, I, I got to apologize. But I don't really know how to do it. You know, I, I didn't know how to beat their ass without Google. So I don't know how to apologize without Google. So not only did you consult Google for how to thoroughly beat their ass, but you also search Google for how to thoroughly apologize after beating their ass. So Google fucking got an assist on your, 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 the ass beating you gave to your friend and your brother and also was getting an assist on the apology. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? What the fuck? 
you know, if you had to apologize, that means you probably beat your brother and your friend. So congrats on winning the 1v1 um, or the 2v1. You know, I don't know if it was both at the same time or, you know, later. But, I mean, uh, I guess so. Um, then you played FNAF afterwards, you know, reflect on your actions and, you know, just calm down. And then somehow that made you think of Aster. And then you started looking about potatoes because... Why not eat potatoes when you're playing FNAF and looking at an Astro Arcadia PNG? That's that's crazy. Uh, nice to see a fellow Kyomi is also a fellow accountant. Corporate weeps for the win. Yeah, bro. Bro, fucking like, I don't know. Business majors are so... Ah! Sorry, I was a business student. Um, Kyoga, thanks for super chat. Allegedly, I'm studying program and have accountancy in my subject. Unfortunately, I searched Enna because I play a cosplayer. I love how you're just like mid homework. Like, yeah, let me just search Enna. You know, let me just see. What's the cat off one? It's fairy core aesthetic. All right, next one. Okay, sometimes I forget stuff. Golf codes, please donate codes. Pursue, kill me reference. When is Thanksgiving? Kill me mascot reference. Login, what does gambling mean? YouTube, 3DS games. Shirt line art is taking four tablets of Advil 90 milligrams bad and cottage core. What the fuck is cottage? I just be learning new shit. Roblox outfits. Um. Yeah, you do forget things a lot, bro. You had to look up references for like the kill me mascot twice. So you looked at it, you forgot. You forgot, also forgot when Thanksgiving was. And then you looked at when the Kill Me Mascot reference was again. And then you're like, shit, did I OD on some Advil? Fuck. You know? Shit. I mean, low key, this isn't like, this is kind of normal. I feel like search histories, they're either like fucking ass random or like, they're like pretty normal like i don't think there's like really like an in-between you know it's like random shit or like it's like a chronological event you know all right next one okay shirley shally let's look at this kyo kaneko body pillow What you mean? What, what you mean by that? Huh? What you, what you mean by that? Huh? You want to cuddle with me or something? Is that what you're saying, stupid? Yo, what happened to this no parasocial stuff, chat? I thought we were, I thought we were, we were better than this, man. Now you trying to cuddle with me? What the fuck? Whoa, yo, 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 yo. What happened to no parasocial? Okay, then there's this fan art. I don't know who the, who, uh, is that a, I think this is something to do with Genshin or their Genshin streamer. I've seen this name with a Genshin icon on Twitter before. I don't remember what the fuck they were talking about because I don't know shit about Genshin, but it was Genshin related. Fruit and nut synonyms. Okay. A song. Um, NU Carnival Guide. Kyo Kaneko NU Carnival. Okay. Yo, I didn't forget what the fuck NU Carnival was the one time y'all made me look that shit up, okay? Don't, don't add, you are not innocent. You are not innocent, okay? You are not innocent. Magazine BX Boy English. Therapy game plot. So, so. So you trying to tell me. So what I've learned from this is you're down bad. You know, you're down bad. I don't know what, you know, what is causing the down badness, but you know, you like, you know, I guess you played the Kill Conoco and you carnival mod or whatever. And then you're like, damn, bro, this is fake. I need something real. So then you ordered the Kill Conoco body pillow afterward, you know? And then they said, I don't know who this is. Okay. But then they said rule 34. So I don't know what rule 30, you know, I mean, I'm just saying, bro, like you kind of, I ain't trying to say you like, you know, horny, but like, I'm just saying like, you not innocent either. You know, I, you know, it's a Genshin ship. Oh, of course it's a Genshin ship. Damn, bro. Yo, you're horny, dog. I don't know. <laughs>
<laughs> I don't know what to say, man. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna say you're horny. It's okay. You know, you're um you're you're down bad. You're in the trenches. Um, some people are down bad, you know, some people are on the floor, some people in the Grand Canyon, some people like in hell. Um, I, whatever is beneath that, you know, like what like the eighth circle or some shit, like you deep in that bitch. But it's okay, you know. I mean, shit happens. <laughs> Someone said fellow person in the trenches. <laughs> Salute emoji. All right, next one. How cookies are made? A pinched nerve. How to merge two columns in Excel. Boy, girlfriend. Some Genshin character again. Okay, this is pretty normal. It's just they're kind of random, bro. You're like, how do I merge columns in Excel? How are cookies made? Lyrics, a pinched nerve. Lyrics. This is pretty normal. This is actually, this is like the least tame. Or no, pause. This is one of the tame ones. I don't know what boy girlfriend is. Um, I'm a bit confused by that. Cause I don't know how you, I don't know how, what, I don't know what that is. But, you know, it's a webtoon. Oh, okay. Hagnahari is good. Oh, my, is, wait, what, is, is it that a, is that a Genshin character? Yo, I didn't know there were so many Genshin people in here, bro. Y'all, y'all like, wait, put one in chat if you play Genshin, okay? Two in chat if you don't. I just feel like I never play Genshin. One in chat if you play Genshin, two if you don't. Damn, there's a lot of Genshin people in here. Shit. Okay, there's some twos too. Okay, okay, I'm not alone. Someone's like, negative one, I used to. Half, I stopped. 1.5. Damn, okay. Mendy, thanks for the nine months. When are you going to give it a try? Uh, whenever I'm like a billionaire and like money is not, a you know, an, an asset to me. And like, I can like, you know, wail and not feel bad, you know? Currently, I'm like in the, the if I wail, I feel bad arc. You feel me? All right, next. I don't know why I'm laughing. Okay, d d derivative pricing. LOL Esports. Okay, you were watching Worlds. Private browsing safari. Oh, okay. You trying to look up some. You trying to look up some some stuff undetected. Hmm. 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 Okay. Council tax. Self fridges Christmas calendar. Laughing brain temperature. What? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Laughing brain, like the temperature your brain is when you laugh. Huh? <laughs> what? And then afterward, we're like, oh yeah, you know, Riot Games, London, Nintendo Finance job, you know, like it's all, it's all like pretty normal gaming related stuff or like random stuff. And then in the middle of all this, like, normal stuff like all these other searches i would say go together okay but then they're just like laughing brain temperature i'm confused what is what do you mean what the fuck do you mean do you feel like do you feel like your body gets like really hot or cold when you laugh what laughing brain temperature i don't know why laughing brain temperature is there what the Low-key, I never thought of that. I was never like, maybe when you laugh, your brain temperature changes. That has not once in my life crossed my mind at all. Someone was like, what is laughing brain temperature? A Genshin character? I would not be surprised, you know? Sounds like, a, sounds like some weird attack from like some like fucking like anime or some shit. Some like shitty translated dub. Like, nah, no, I'm going to use laughing brain temperature, you know? That's, that's, I mean, Loki, like, now that you said that, like, I'm kind of thinking, like, does your temperature of your brain change when you laugh? I don't know. I never in my life thought of that. 
Not once. Now I did. Sounds like some video game movie. Yeah, it sounds like some weird like Mortal Kombat fatality bullshit. You know? Alright, next one. Context for Edging Club. Someone in my uni posted a Reddit and I knew it was a joke, but I was curious. Okay, let's look at this shit, bro. <laughs> Yo! I ain't gonna say shit about the first one. I just... <laughs> Yo! Yo, bro, it's okay, man. Your parents will apologize maybe one day, okay? It's okay, bro. Maybe one day your parents will apologize, you know? I know it's hard for them to never say sorry, but, you know, you can just... It, it might happen one day, okay? It's okay, you know? Y you know? Can I get paid to sleep is wild. Part-time jobs near me. Why do Asian parents never apologize? Okay, here's my theory, all right? Here's my theory. Here's my theory, bro. Their parents wanted them to get a job. So they were looking at jobs. And then, like, because they couldn't find a job, um, their parents got mad at them. So then they Googled, why do parents never apologize? That's my, that's my theory. That's my theory. Okay, that is my entire theory, you know? Now, before that, though, what is an edging club? I don't know. What the fuck is an edging club? Uh, Leah, you, you tell me, huh? What you, what you mean by that? Edging club. The edging club is wild, bro. Yo, you know when they make jokes about like, like band kids doing like, you know, weird, sh like this is the equivalent of that. Why does my brain hurt every time I get up from my bed? Mood. Victoria cosplay, okay. Niji and cosplay. Why does my head hurt when I smell caffeine? And Josh Hutcherson whistle. Yo, can somebody explain to me why Josh Hutcherson is suddenly the face of this whistle meme? Like, isn't that a flow rider song? Like, why? Why is Josh Hutcherson the face of that? I actually don't understand. Like, it doesn't make sense to me. Like, why him? Like... I did it from like 2013. Someone edited him to the song, I think. Oh, shit. And then fucking milk tape being a hater. People find him hot. He's not even all that. Yo, why are you hating? Why are you hating? You bitter people don't find you hot or something, huh? What's wrong with that? Let people find him hot. Okay. Your day, your time will come or it won't. But you know what? Don't hate on people who are having their time. All right. Let him have it. Low-key, there were these two girls I knew. Oh, my God, bro. They were obsessed with this dude. It was a little bit... It was a little bit too much, bro. It was a little bit too much. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, Milk Tay, like, I, I don't completely agree with you in your hater mentality, but, like, I was hating a little bit, okay? Like, bro, when I tell you, like, they were, like, obsessed with this motherfucker. Like, to the point where, like, they were talking about him all the time. And I was like, dog, you're, like, 13. He's, like... 20 something like it's not happening bitch like it's like what the fuck you know it was just too much they were talking about it all the time this was like when like hunger games was like peak popularity or whatever and i was like bro i was like i was like hello i was like what this is a bit much but yeah they were obsessed they were obsessed Alright, next one. Okay, Shoto singing, scat, pause. What? What the fuck? That better be the music, the music scat. That better be the music scat. That better be the musical scat. That better be the musical version of that word. Okay, there's two definitions. This can go one of two ways. And it better be the one that involves some singing and dancing. Some shit. You know, some of that shit. All right. Someone's like, what other scat is there? 
Don't don't worry about it. I'm gonna assume it's the music one because they were looking up lyrics and Shoto singing. So I'm gonna assume it's the music kind. But if it's not the music kind, I'm gonna be like a little disappointed, you know? Me personally. They're like in during chat like it wasn't, bro. Alright, alright, all right, all right. <laughs> Not you defending yourself. That's crazy. Okay, I Evelyn birthday uwu rap. Okay, okay. Check it out. Check it out. Let's get louder. Okay, Luxium. Okay, okay, okay. They're a they're a Ike Evelyn fan. They like Luxium and they like Shoto. Okay, cool. All right, and they like Scat. Um, I'm not gonna elaborate. They 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 typed it, not me. <laughs> All right, next one. I'm not going insane, I swear. Well, let's see. Let's see. I'll be the judge of that. How old do you have to be to go to the asylum? How old do you have to be to go to the insane asylum? How old do you have to be to go to a mental hospital? High school DD, what are the benefits of getting boosted in Discord? Discord? Okay. Bestie, how do I tell you this? Um. <laughs> uh, you might be going through it, you know? Uh, you know, I mean, I don't know if insane is the right word, but you... You might be going through it a little bit, you know. You might be you might be having a little bit of a rough situation, you know, a little bit of a rough patch, a sore spot, you know. Something might be going on, maybe, you know. And it's okay, you know. It's fine. Don't don't worry about it. You know, hang in there. You got this shit. Um, you know, um, watch more High School DD. You know, look at the the plot, you know, and the physics of the plot, and the way the plot moves, and you'll feel a little bit better. I think I'm not a doctor. I really don't know, but you know, I'm just, you know. All right, next one. Okay, Kokoro Connect best scene, Pinterest AO3, Chai Discord, MBTI test. Okay, Jinx Chapter 39. All right, you know what? This is pretty normal, you know? This is pretty normal. Also, Why is everyone saying not Jinx? Well, I thought it, Jinx was the League of Legends. I thought Jinx was League of Legends. What? Wait, wait it's not League of Legends related? Oh shit! Yo, listen, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have known that you were crazy, but like, you know, my chat, they making you, they making you seem crazy right now. So I'm gonna just assume you crazy, but like, I really don't know for real. So I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just delete that off the notepad. I got you, bro. It's not even there, you know, for real. Okay. Anyways, but they're based, okay? Not because of that, but because they like Kokoro Connect, okay? That anime is fire. That shit was the thing I watched in high school like five times when I was sick and couldn't attend high school, so I felt like I went to high school. It was great. Love that show. Inaba is best girl, and if you disagree with me, um, you like whiny, annoying bitches. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just super saying. See, Chai is still on the screen. Is Chai? I thought Chai was like a T thing. Is Chai some crazy too? What the fuck? Yo, I don't even. Yo, see, y'all can just slip shit under my nose and I don't even know. I thought Chai. I thought Chai was like Chai T. You know? I thought they were like looking up like the T ingredient. Oh, it's character AI. Oh, I mean, that's not terrible. Yo, you too innocent. What? Well, yo, how am I supposed to know? I'm not in the know. I don't know about all this stuff, guys. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a new, I'm new to this, um, this, this, this sort of thing. Yu Yu, thanks for the five gifted. Thank you. Thank you. And Mendy, thanks for the nine months. Bro, I have no idea. Realistically, like, you could slip shot of my nose. I don't even know. There was some stuff that I like, I, I had no clue what it could possibly be. So I didn't put it in because I was scared it was going to be some like crazy shit. But even when I thought it was okay, like apparently it's not okay. Because I don't even know about this shit. I don't even know what the Jinx chapter 39 is. 
I thought it was like you know like like arcane league of legends type b i didn't i thought it was like maybe i thought maybe there was like a manga for that shit you know gabby thanks for the super chat i have a singular word fountain i don't like that that verbiage i'm good that's a bit too much i don't i don't need all that that's that's crazy um that's crazy fountain what does fountain mean no don't tell me actually no shut up chat don't tell me shit but i don't want to know i do not want to know don't inform me do not tell me i don't need to know i i i listen i'm smart enough that i can put two and two together i assumed okay you know i know all right okay you know i don't need you to explain to me you know that there was a lot of um a certain liquid happening in a certain environment with certain context that may or may not be appropriate you know i, I listen i get I, i'm picking up what they're putting down i'm picking it up it might be worse than that but i'm picking it up just a little bit allegedly i'm using my context clues you know when they say in you know english class you look around the word to figure out what it means i'm looking around the word right now but y'all y'all you listen everyone in chat that freaks out over this shit you guilty too motherfucker you self-reporting in the chat all right, listen, if you want to know if any of your friends that watch the stream are also degenerates, just look at their reaction in chat to when some degeneracy pops up on the screen because they're going to self-report. If they know what it is, they listen, you self-reporting, stupid. We know, we know, we know. You didn't think about all that, did you? Yeah, I'm guilty and I'm not ashamed. You know what? Shout out to you. Shout out to you, bro. Rambo, uh, thanks for the super chat. Juicy. Corbin's fine. Thanks for four months. I've never been so confused in my life. Is there anything I can search up? Love you, kill and kill me. Just don't, don't worry about it. Just don't, just don't worry about it. Just don't worry about it. You know, just it's maybe it's sometimes it's better to like be not to be ignorant, you know, to not be informed. You know, sometimes ignorance is literally bliss. You just, you don't want to know. Cause once you know, you, you can't unknow, you know, you can't, you can't forget you can't forget as easily as you might hope you can, okay? You know? So it's better to sometimes just not know, just not understand what's happening. Maybe not understand, you know, like what, you know, um, is all popping up on screen. You know, it's it can be better. Yo, y'all motherfuckers making me look like Mother Teresa. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like realistically, like I do not read the NSF or look at the NSF stuff like that. Low key, y'all make me feel pure. Yo, shout out to you. See, sometimes I worry I'm deranged, you know, but like, you know, every time I do stuff like this, I'm like, damn, you know, I'm like, <laughs> no, I'm like Mother Teresa, you know, I'm a saint. I'm like fucking, I'm a monk. What the fuck? I'm a monk. All right, next one. Pickup lines. How to remove stapler and thumb. Dog, you did not staple your thumb. <laughs> you did not staple your thumb, bro. That's crazy. I don't know. I was just like, yeah, you know, pickup lines, AO3. Uh, how do I remove the stapler from my thumb? Um, this shit kind of hurt. You know? <laughs> when was Hot Topic a thing? Lab collaborative. What do you call things at the skate park? Trapped in TikTok, the virus. Florida man, December 25th. I'm assuming December 25th is your birthday. And you did that trend of looking at the Florida man. You know what? Let's look if there's a Florida man on my birthday, okay? Florida man, December 29th. Let's see. What happened on December 29th? Florida man accused of setting his own truck on fire to give deputies, quote, something to do. Damn. Damn. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> that's cr that's crazy, bro. That's crazy. That's cr <laughs> low key. That kind of fits me. You know, I feel like you know how they have horoscopes. There's like they gotta have like a Florida man scope. Like 
You know, I feel like, you know, what the Florida man did on your birthday, you know, is somehow like reflective of your personality. Okay, you know, they were providing entertainment for the police, you know, and I provide entertainment for you guys. So, low, you know, I think it fits. I think if I was crazy, I think maybe that is something I would do, you know. I think it fits. So, if you ever look up your Florida mandate, you know, I think it's indicative of your personality, maybe. This fuck zodiac signs, okay? Fuck zodiac signs, fuck the MBTI, all that bullshit. Just look up your Florida mandate. And let me know, okay? I'm gonna start asking people when I meet them, yo, what's your Florida, what, what what happened on your Florida mandate? And they tell me, and then I'll be like, damn, bro, this person's a little too crazy. I gotta, you know, I gotta keep my distance. They 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 killed 36 people? Like, shit, the Florida man killed 36 people on their birthday? Damn, bro, they might be a little bit crazy. I need to, you know, I need to keep my distance, you know? So maybe we should start doing that. Fuck horoscopes, okay? I'm now officially a Florida man scope believer, all right? Okay, then everything else is kind of normal. <laughs> oh, and how to remove a stapler and thumb, bro. <laughs> I don't know why. That's so funny. Mom was at a Florida man was arrested for kicking swans in the head. Damn, bro. You fucking hate animals like that? That's crazy. Taco Bell robbery? That is so tame. Florida man threw spaghetti at his mother is mine. Okay, that just... You might have... You might have some... some you might have some family troubles. You know, that's what I'm getting from that. You might have some family trouble. Maybe a strained relationship with someone you're, you know, uh, that you share blood with, you know? Mine is Florida man kills his grandma and walks around with a bloody for five hours. You might be crazy, so I'm gonna keep my distance from you. Um, you know, uh, yeah. Mine's bringing an alligator to Wendy's. Okay, I mean, you're... You might be a nature lover, you know, or you're just that guy. You just don't care. You know, that might be what that means, you know? I'm just saying. Mine was die from microwaving a microwave. That just means you're the person that the type of person that wants to fuck around and find out, you know? You want to fuck around and find out, you know? You want to fuck around and see. And that can be dangerous sometimes. Four man accused of stealing crossbow by shoving it down his sweatpants. Four man with tries to wear underwear as a mask. Okay, you know, you just, you, you, you get a little silly goofy mood sometimes, you know? You know what? Maybe I should do that. For Florida man stream, okay? I'll do a stream where you tell me your Florida man dates. You submit a screenshot and I'll, I'll try to psychoanalyze you. I'll like create a, a per, type of person I think you are. You know, I got you. All right, next. Genshin Impact Genshin. That's something in Genshin. That's something in Genshin. Why is my ear ringing? Five Nights at Freddy's Silk Flower location. Okay, okay, okay. So literally, they're just Googling shit in the game. And then randomly, they're just like, damn, bro, why the fuck are my ears ringing? <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. They're like, they're just vibing, looking up information for games. And then they're just like, hey, yo, why, why the fuck my ears ringing? You know, I'm not gonna lie. I do this when I play Final Fantasy sometimes. I'll like open a tab on my second monitor and just start Googling like where shit is or like a different items or like what final bosses. Are. So I, you know, I feel you. I do this. Very nice. Thanks. Shout out to wikis, you know, like fan wikis, bro. I use those all the time. All right, next one. My history is all over the place, bruh. Okay, we got sweet potato dog cum lord. What the fuck? What? I think I'm I don't know if like the type of brain you know chemistry that you have is like the same as mine I think your anatomy is a little bit different because I don't know what the fuck we are talking about I don't know what I, I can't even begin to fathom what this could mean I'm gonna be honest I really can't begin to fathom what a sweet potato dog cum lord is is supposed to be 
what it looks like, what it actually is. Like I, there's no words for this. It's just like four key, three key phrases that should just never be next to each other are next to each other. There's sweet potato, there's dog, and there's come with. Like when the fuck are those like next to each other describing shit ever? What? The fuck? Um. Anyways. Next one. Okay. Sino Genshin. Sino Genshin voice actor. Yo, how you not know who Sino is, bro? Come on. Come on. He's a VTuber. You don't know? You don't know about my man? You know about my man Sayu like that? That's crazy. How dare? How dare? I'm kidding. <laughs> Line. Hex Haywire. Okay. Dark Vintage Looped Bunny Plush. Okay. How to block users on... Di see blocked users. People at party meme. Okay. Everyone's telling me to Google this, the, the dog thing. Hold on. Sweet. So someone named their Pomeranian cum lord and makes videos of the Pomeranian doing shit. And one of them is with a sweet potato. What the fuck? I'm not gonna lie. I'm less confused, but I'm still confused. And the dog's dead too? Listen, this has been a roller coaster of emotions that I uh, um, emotions that I did not expect to experience at this time. Yo, my thing is first of all, okay. Listen, I know there's not like a there's not like a uh you know, I know dogs can't sue their owners, you know, for for um animal abuse, but if I was a dog and I was named Come Lord, like I'm taking you to court, okay? There's no way we're duking this out like um in any place other than a legal context. I need my bag for you fucking up my name, okay? That's all I'm saying. It's like, it's like, it's like the people that name their kids some fuck shit, like Elon Musk, like I'm suing. If I'm Elon Musk's son that's named X Ash 12, okay? I'm suing you. You got money, I want money, and I feel wronged by you. So why the fuck not? I guarantee I could find a lawyer that would be more than happy to help me if I said I would split the profits if they if we won. Because you know you're getting a bag for that, bro. If anything, I would be grateful my dad named me some fuck shit like that. You know, I'd be like, damn, I get to sue you for a fuck ton of money, you know, if I was Elon's son. So word. That's crazy, though. All right, next one. We got Romeo and Juliet similarities, TDI Noah, Island of the Slaughter Noah, five most important events in To Kill a Mockingbird, Just Dance, Last Night, another name, Gmail, Google Classroom, and then Chloroform. Not only. Not only. Do you use light mode, which is already makes you a psychopath, but you Googled chloroform while using light mode. So you're just like, you are going to kill someone. Like there's no other explanation. Light mode and you're Googling chloroform. Like you can't sin twice and have both sins be that bad. Like, I'm just saying, like, there's something going on. There's some fuckery, okay? There's there's some weird action. There's some criminal activity. There's some ethical violations. There's no way, there's no way you're on light mode and Googling shit about chloroform. There's no way. I, I cannot believe. Yo, listen, if you ever come to a Kill Conical meet and greet, like I'm gonna need like a like a like a like a five foot like distance. Okay, like I'm gonna need you to stand back. Cause like you're not gonna chloroform me. I might even hire security, okay? 
You know, so if there, someone gets chloroformed, it's like, you know, my security guard. Because what the fuck? That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right, next one. Pretty normal, right? Okay, for context, I was having a debate with my friends about cannibalism. Okay. Omega versus anatomy. This is not normal. You're okay. You're already lying to me. You you said pretty normal. What you what? Stop. St the first the first search is already out of pocket. Then you're like, is cannibalism illegal? And then you're like, Vizalia's bandage birthday. How to find a pookie? Okay. What happens if you eat human flesh? And outlet birds of time. What happens if you eat human flesh? How to find a pookie? Vizalia's bandage birthday. Is cannibalism illegal? How does your brain go from like one to the next, man? Like you were on some wholesome shit. Then you're on some like, what happens if you eat people? Like what we're doing? Like, well, how did we get here? And then they said like they got in an argument with their friend about cannibalism. But my thing is like, dog. You trying to tell me in between the argument with your friend, you Googled how to find a pookie and Vizalius bandaged birthday and then returned to the argument and asked if cannibalism is illegal. I don't find that very believable okay there's no way you you google search two things in between the these two relevant searches if you were in an argument because when you're in an argument you try to get your facts right as quickly as possible so you should have googled what happens if you eat human flesh and then afterward after your friend hit back in the argument you google if cannibalism is illegal but instead you had time to google two things in between two things in between which means this this whole thing about being in an argument i don't believe you i think you're i think you're lying i think you're lying and you know what we need time stamps we need time stamps I, we need a time stamps okay i need the time stamps of these searches because otherwise there's no way and you use light mode oh my god Nah, you didn't even get in an argument with your friend. You just wanted to know if it was illegal. Is that what you're trying to tell me? And I feel like you searched two random shits afterward. Like, nah. Nah. Nah, I remember one time I Googled this. I don't remember what. I think I got in, we got in a discussion about it. And I don't know. I think it depends. But I don't even know if like. Actually, the eating of people is illegal. I think it's like the killing part is but i could be wrong loki i don't remember one of my friends like was googling this shit and i was like i just think it's illegal regardless and my friend was like well technically and i was like okay bro you know if you want to google this you know shout out to you anyways i'm just saying um some of y'all are going to be on the fbi watch list okay i mean i'm just saying like you know you got to be on a list somewhere I don't know how they create their lists, but if I was an FBI agent and I saw this search history, like I'm creating a list for sure. Okay, you're getting your name written down and I'm documenting your searches from now on. Cause there's there's something crazy going on here. Something crazy going on right here. Boop, boop, boop. Next. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know what it was. I have dark mode on Google, but when I type in the search bar, it's light mode. I don't know why. All right, next one. I don't know why my searches... I search up starch. I thought it would be a good name for my future pet. Okay, they just Googled Finana, Alira, and Nijisanji, and then starch. All right, I'm gonna be honest, bro. I'm gonna be honest, Okay. I realistically don't think Starch is a good name for your pet. I'm going I'm to give you my opinion, okay? You told me. You told me. I don't think Starch is a good name for your pet. Um, I don't know. Maybe if it's a fish, okay? You know, if it's a, like, white fish, I could feel, I could feel Starch being a vibe. But other than that, I don't know. It's like naming your pet glucose. Like who the f you know what I'm saying? It's like naming your pet glucose. Like who the fuck is gonna name their pet glucose? They're like oh it's it's sugar so it's supposed to be cute. I don't give a fuck. Glucose? Not you saying glucose is a fire name. That's crazy. 
Glucose? Glucose? Stop. Stop lying to me. You're not about to name, you're not about to name your fucking, you're not about to name your dog Glucose. Be for real. Fructose? Nah, fructose is not good either. Fructose, glucose, none of that shit. Starch is more, is more, is more chill. I'm not gonna lie. Starch, okay, I'm dragging it. Okay, glucose is not as bad. But I don't know, man. Me personally, I think glucose starch is more of a fish name, you know. If it's like a dog, you name it starch, I just feel like that's disrespectful to the dog, you know? Like that doesn't give dog vibes. It's like those people that name their dog like human names. I'm like, what the fuck? Well, actually, that's not that weird. But like there's some names that are like they're just human names. Like who the fuck's gonna like be real, be for real. Who the fuck is gonna name their dog like Bob? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, imagine being like, what's up, Bob? Like, that is just that just doesn't sound right to me. Like, why? Like, there are some names that are just like they're human exclusive. Okay. That's like naming a dog Bob. Who in their right mind is gonna name their dog Bob? If you name your dog Bob, like I that's weird. I don't know what it is. It, it's weird. You know, like it just it just doesn't fit right. It's not a dog human exclusive name. Like, that is a human only name. Okay. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes dogs and humans share names is fine. But Bob is so human. Like, I can't imagine looking at some cute ass puppy and being like, hello, Bob. Nah. Bob goes hard. Bob's a good fish name. Bob is a good fish name, bro. Fish names, good fish names are just names that sound a little bit off. I've kind of figured it out. Like they just had they just have to sound a little bit quirky for no reason and then it works. You know, my friend used to have a has a dog named Steve, okay? And the first few months he had Steve, we weren't used to him having Steve yet, so he would randomly just like t like talk to us and he was like like we'd call him and he'd be like, "Oh, sorry guys, you know, I just got done, you know, cuddling with Steve." And we were all like we're all like, "Yo, is this like is he into guys now? Like he cuddling like with the dude? Like what's he and he didn't like tell us like what's happening? Like like he, he did it, he said it so casually. Like, you know, I feel like he would like made a bigger deal out of this. You know, we were like, we were like, we were kind of trying to debate if like he had a boyfriend or something. Because we were like, we just felt like it was very casual to just bring up, right? Nothing wrong with having a boyfriend, but we just thought him bring it up so casually and never saying anything was just like odd. All right. And then like we were like, he was like, we were like, we're like, who? The f and then my friend was like, the one friend who just never shuts up was like, yo, who the fuck is Steve? I was like, is that your boyfriend? And then he's like, no, Steve is my dog. And we were like, oh, <laughs> we were like, oh, okay. But literally it would throw, it threw me off for like the first month. He'd be like, yeah, guys, sorry. I was coming with Steve. And I was like, every time I'd be like, Steve. Steve and I'd be like oh it's his dog like it took me a while to like get used to it your dog or your d-a-w-g dog oh shit I don't know man you meet Steve no but I've seen pictures pros dating a minecraft character yeah my fault bro <laughs> so funny though all right next one thank you for translating because I'm stupid thank you Okay, why only tied up thumb? What? Twitter birds never fly. Okay. Yashiro BL. Escape room BL manga. Okay. Okay. Power. Cry me a river manga. Exo late half anniversary. The emotion quiz. Yo, this translation is a little bit crazy. I'm not gonna lie, bro. The, the translator app did you dirty. Can someone, can someone explain to me what the we only tied up thumb is? Does anyone know? I'm just curious.
anyways um you're a you're 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 a fujo it's okay you know um it's fine you know or what's the term fujoshi i don't remember shout out to you you know according to my chat this is like mostly bl so shout out to you you know all right next one <laughs> okay this one had nothing to do with what they searched i just thought it was really fucking funny that instead of screenshotting the fucking search history they pulled out a separate device took a photo and then uploaded it onto twitter <laughs> like they pulled up their search history on their computer and then took out their phone took a picture and then tweeted it instead of just like you know using the snipping tool or fucking like printing printing their screen like, i don't know why it's so funny to me but i was just like bro <laughs> like dog it's so much easier to just screenshot on your computer but i mean <laughs> boomer vibes but shout out to you you know i appreciate the creativity but you can screenshot on your computer you know I'm just telling you it's a thing all right next one translate writing on the wall phony christmas meme i have <laughs> this is what i'm saying bro sometimes y'all just search the most random shit out of nowhere they're like how to pronounce this what's bl it's christmas meme phony kill conical lyrics and then they're just randomly searching like i have boiled water spilled all over my hands like what the fuck is Google going to do for you, bitch? What is Google going to do? You think Google's going to, like, unburn your hands? You think Google's going to, like, fix the boiled water that you spilled on your hands? You decided to Google that instead of, like, putting your hands under some ice water? Like, what? You know, if anything, you could have gone to, like, you know, like, an urgent care or something if you're worried you got burns. But instead, you're like, let me just Google. I spill boiled water all over my hands. Because, you know, like, it don't matter. I don't even know how you type this shit. If you had if you had boiled water all over your hands, how did you type? Did you have someone type for you? Like, I'm I'm so confused. I have so many questions. Like, how did you type this with your fucking burnt ass hand? What? I don't even. I don't even even know. Did you like voice? Pope typed it with their toes. They used the grippers. maybe they maybe maybe they use like the voice activation but i just think it's funny it's like how to pronounce integration noun it's back christmas me phony and then they're just like i've spilled boiled water spit all over my hands I'm like bro I'm like i'm like bro how is how is google gonna help man all right next one Okay, how to get my hu husband on my side. Translator, near, far, wherever you are. Sweden, ginger cake, three recipe. How to clean your ears popular, properly. Thermal socks, ice cream cake. Okay, so uh, you're like, I'm not gonna lie. The stuff you Google, it, it gives the vibe that you're like a mom. You know, I don't know why, but it's like, it's just like random simple shit. You know, it kind of reminds me of like some shit like some random like you know like 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 you know either like like stay at home mom kind of vibes okay or boomer vibes you know and then there's the first one where it's like how to get my husband on my side that's what i'm saying guys sometimes google can't help you know like how is Google gonna tell you how to get your husband on your side? Like what, what like what are we doing, man? Sometimes you need to like talk to a friend, okay? You know? Talk to talk to anything, okay? Talking to Google is crazy. It's crazy. It's a webcomic. Oh shit. See, I don't know anything, man. Y'all motherfuckers, y'all are... How do you have time to know all of this? 
Do y'all just read every day? I don't even know what a manhua is. Is, is that a is that a manga? What's that? Low key though. Sometimes fucking the titles they have for these shits are weird. Sometimes even for anime, man. Like that anime called like I want to eat your pancreas. Like out of context, like that would be crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Like out of context, like bro, like what the fuck? I remember the first time I saw that, I was like, what the fuck deranged type of shit is this? And then my, everyone was like, no, it's a really, it's a really good anime. Trust me. And I'm like, I was like, what the fuck are you? It's called, what? hello? So. Word. Okay. Oh, so either that or you're fighting with your husband. I prefer the narrative that you're fighting with your husband because it's more interesting. So if you fight with your husband, um, listen. Don't go to Google, okay? Google's not going to help you. You know? Fuck, fuck the... F fuck it being a story. This is real life, okay? All right. Listen. They, they already give off middle-aged mom vibes. I think it's real. It's not... No, 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 guys. It's real, okay? They are fighting with their husband. So, talk to a friend, you know? All right, next one. 153 centimeters in feet. Wheel of names. Urban dictionary. Curse Niji Sanji PNGs. Free Niji Sanji merch. Hey! Buy, buy our shit normally, stupid. Okay. How to make a VTuber model without eternal suffering. Okay, that's a mood. And am I gay or am I gay? <laughs> what you mean? What you mean, am I gay or am I gay? What, what is the or? What, 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 what's the difference between the two questions? Are you like... Are you like... 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 I don't... I don't... What, there's no other option. Like you're not even you're not even like proposing the idea that you're straight. You're just like, am I gay or am I gay? So it's like the only option is you're gay. You know what I'm saying? Like, where is the where is the question? It's okay. You're going through it. You know, I, I, it, it happens. You know, you'll you'll figure it out. You know, don't don't worry about it. You know. I don't know if Google can tell you though. <laughs> Then underneath that, how to make a VTuber model without eternal suffering. You can't. Okay, listen, guys. I hate to break it to you. You either need you either need a lot of money or a lot of time. Or both. Because uh, uh, live 2D isn't free. So, you know. I mean, I'm just saying. Am I gay or am I gay? Yes. Exactly. Uh, Hoshi, thanks for Super Chat. My mom sims for Ike, Evelyn, help. That's crazy. Shout out to Ike, Evelyn. You know, he pulling the MILFs. How much does a VTuber model cost? It low-key depends. Like, some VTuber models are, like, cheaper, and some are more expensive. Like, I've seen some go for, like, $1,000. I've seen some go for, like, $10,000. Depends on the artist and the rigor, how good the rigging is, how good the artist is, how popular the artist is on top of how good they were. It depends. What if you draw it yourself? Um, I mean, then you'd save money on the art. How much does your model cost? Uh, I don't know. And if I knew, I would not be allowed to answer. Boop, boop, boop. My, my advice is if you want to get a cheap uh cheaper v2 model just use an artist that isn't super well known because the more well known they are the more booked they are so the higher they have to make their prices so that they have a fewer customers and b can like be better with their work you know so applied demand so if you find a like a, a less popular artist because there are a lot of artists that like aren't super popular that are very good 
Um, so. But I would make sure they've like done stuff before, obviously. Ba -ba -ba. Shit, almost as expensive as the first two. Sometimes it's more. All right, next one. Okay, we got Corn Hub. What do you mean by that? You know, there actually is a website called Corn Hub where they have different types of corn. I don't remember who showed me this. One of my friends showed me this. It's actually a real thing. Corn Hub, like, like dead ass, like, no, no, like, like the word Corn Hub, like, dot com is a real website where they have fucking images of corn. I'm so serious. And it's made to look like the real site, but with like corn. If I recall correctly, I don't know. I was shown this, this, this website like five years ago, but it's a real thing. It's a real, I'll be viewing it tonight. Yo, pause. Okay. Then there's NU Carnival apparently written in there. I didn't even notice that. And then you fucking Rick rolled me too. What the fuck? Yo, never going to give you up. Hello. That's crazy. How did you manage to rickroll me with your search history? How? Like, I don't even feel like this was like planned. This seems like a natural progression of searches. Like, I feel like you just did it on accident. But I don't know if that's like more disrespectful or less disrespectful. I really can't decide. Why is corn have a thing? Because someone thought it was funny. I don't know. Sometimes people just do shit for fun, you know? Uh, Miko, thanks so much for the 14 months. Going off to work. Thanks for starting my day funny. Well, thank you. Thank you for watching, man. I hope you enjoy work or enjoy it as much as you can. All right, next one. I can explain. I guarantee you fucking can't. All right, next one. How to get some sleep. How to lock your friend in a locker room. How to say what you feel without being rude. Character AI. How to keep bills low. Stray Kids concert. How to keep bills low fast. How to say what you feel without being rude. So I can tell you have problems expressing how you feel. Uh, <laughs> I can, uh, I can, I can tell you have problems uh, expressing how you feel. Um, you know, I mean, uh, you know, uh, sometimes using, uh, <laughs> there's, there's lots to unpack here. <laughs> sometimes, uh, you know, um, you know, I mean, I think you really want to go to the Stray Kids concert, too, because you were looking like how to keep your bills low, how to keep bills low fast. I really think you you want to you want to be able to afford a ticket to that to that Stray Kids concert, too. You know, so you're trying to keep your bills low to, you know, save money for the Stray Kids concert. And you're trying to say what you what you will feel without being rude. And you're using you play character. I, I. Maybe listen, guy. I don't know how good character AI is, but maybe you could practice saying stuff without being rude to character AI. Or maybe that's what you do. Okay, but I'm also confused. Why the fuck you want to lock your friend in a locker room? Like, why do you care about how to say what you feel without being rude if you're willing to like lock someone in a locker room? Like, I don't understand. Like, Character AI taught me how to flirt. That is crazy. Yeah, how are you gonna lock your friend in a locker room, but then also be like, I care about how people's feelings. Wait, wait, uh, uh, no, you don't, stupid. What, what you mean? You know, I don't know, man. I'm getting, I'm getting some conflicting messaging here, but I do know you want to go to the um, Stray Kids concert. And also, if they were your enemy, you wouldn't look up friend. You just look up how to lock someone in a locker room. I need an explanation. This search history, like, you know, when you said I can explain, I don't know if you can, man. Why are you, why are you trying to lock people in locker rooms and be nicer at the same time? They want to be polite while doing it. Yeah. Sorry, friend. Um, I really feel like you belong in this locker room and I'm going to be really, 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 
really honest with you that I hope you're stuck in here forever. And I hope that doesn't come off as being rude. Dog. Whether they deserve it, Kyo? Ah, like, some, there's better ways to deal with things. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know what the first one is. USA map, Hunger Games, product rule, how to send an email politely, Discord, and Twitter. How to end an email politely. How to end an email politely is crazy. How to end an email politely is crazy. Yo, you know, I remember one time in school. Okay, listen. Chat, I know that looks like something that I would potentially Google, okay? But I actually, contrary to popular belief, know how to end emails properly. You want to know how I end them? I just say thanks, comma, and then write my name. Hit enter and then write my name. That's it. You know, fuck best regards because sometimes I'm not wishing you my best regards. Sometimes I'm mad at you, so I'm writing you an email. Okay, fuck sincerely. I don't sincerely know you that well. Okay, I'm not going to be like, love you because of uh, fuck you mean. And I'm not going to be like, you know, giving you my business email, phone number, uh, fucking house address and my three social media accounts. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to say thanks, comma, and then my name. So you know who it's from and you know I'm thanking you for your time. Because sometimes I don't say best wishes or, you know, you know, like all the best. Sometimes I wish you all the worst a little bit, but I'm emailing you because I need something from you. You know, I'm just saying. So I just say thanks. Cause you at least read the email to get to the part where it said thanks. So I appreciate you for reading the email. <laughs> what about yours truly? Yours truly just sounds like you have an ego, you know? Regards, but regards is just best regards, you know? Why not thank you for your time? Why not, why just thanks? Cause thanks takes less time to type. Well, I'll normally, I won't say thanks. I'll say thank you, actually. Yeah. But that's how I feel about writing emails, okay? You know? I'm just saying. Sincerely, um... No. You know, some of, some of this email etiquette, it's like, why? You wanna know what I find it funny? You know when you're in like a chain of like emails, after a while, like someone eventually drops the formality. Like I've been in email chains where like we're emailing back and forth and like, bro, I swear to God, like, like five emails in, the other person will just stop putting the like best regards, all the best, thanks, like ending and stop putting the polite beginning. They'll just type what the fuck they need and hit enter. Like, why can't we just do that from the start? You know what I'm saying? Why can we not just do that from the start? Because, like, ha halfway through the email chain, you're going to drop the, the fucking, you know, polite shit anyways. So, it's like, why can't we just do that from the beginning? You know? They just start texting through email. Like, what was that? What was even the point? Why did I say thanks, comma, my name, the first, like, five emails? Like, what the fuck? Honestly, never mind. Bruh. Thanks for super chat, Peter. All right, next one. Can ice can burn? Question mark. How to turn off a fire alarm? Christmas. Kill conical potato. My PC exploded. What do I do? What potato are you, quiz? How to know if my. What the fuck? I'm like a lie, bro. Your, your emails are wild. Or your search histories are wild. I don't know if my cat can talk. They can't. Okay. Potato salad. Kind of normal. What potato are you quiz is fucking wild. I ain't gonna lie. Like, what in the BuzzFeed quizzes, bro? This is like the, like, what, what is your fucking earlobe? Um, like, like, what type of earwax do you produce? The quiz. Like, what, wh why do you need a quiz to find that out? Who cares? Do you really care what type of potato you are? Like, what? 
And then there's my PC exploded. What do I do? And then later there's like the how to turn off a fire alarm. So your PC exploded and then you had learned, needed to turn off the fire alarm. What the fuck? Yo, that's crazy. One time my PC, it didn't, ex well, it kind of exploded. It like, it like exploded in the case. But like, I, I didn't know why. I was using it and then it just like sparked the fuck out. And like, like, like it looked like some shit like, like it kind of like glowed blue for like two, like half a second. And then like there were sparks and that was it. And I was like, what the fuck? And then my monitor shut off, right? Cause the PC broke. And apparently like my power supply unit like fucking exploded. My power supply unit exploded. And I didn't know why. You know, I used to have the worst luck with PCs. Like sometimes my PCs, I'm so serious. They would just fucking break. Like, no, I'm so serious. Every PC up until this most recent one that I got after I got into Niji. Um, so I think I need to Niji. I could finally afford like a decent PC. Um, everyone broke. Like my first ever PC, the, it exploded randomly one time. Okay. The other one I got after that, like, re like one day the power went out. And then I, when I turned the computer back on, it like corrupted the windows on the PC. So then I had to fix the windows on the PC. But then they were like, the windows isn't broken. The fucking CPU was broken. And I was like, how the fuck did a power outage like break the CPU? So then I got a replacement computer and then the windows got corrupted on that one too. And then I like use, I was on, on, the, on like the phone with Delta or not Delta. What the fuck? Dell, Dell support for like three, four hours, okay? And then finally, after like trying like everything under the sun, it got fixed. And then after that, I got this computer. This computer had issues when I got it too, but they weren't that bad. It was like it, the internet on it wasn't working. So I had to install some drivers and like fucking screw in some shit, but it wasn't that bad because they had, they gave me extra parts, you know, for the PC. But like still, bro, like I used to have the worst luck. I used to have the worst luck, bro. The worst luck. All right, next one. How to make a puffy jacket less puffy. Types of hypoallergenic dogs. Places to adopt dogs. How long will I live? Kung Fu Panda 3. Where to find a Hello Kitty mug. How to animate a foot. Fancy French street names. Fancy French, bro. Fancy French street names is the oddest shit, bro. Fancy French street. Dog's like, yo, I need some fancy names. You know, I need some fancy names. What are some fancy French street names? Like what? I love how they ask Google when, how long will I live? Like, how is Google going to know? I think they're like a writer or maybe they're like an animator or they tell stories or something. And that's why. But then they're just like, I love how they're like, <laughs> this is the funniest part. They're like, how, they're like, how long will I live? And then places to adopt dogs, types of dogs, like low key. They were like, damn, bro. I'm feeling depressed. All right, let's get a puppy. Like, <laughs> I mean, you know what? Sometimes getting a puppy can really help with your mood. Okay. I just think it's funny that the in chronological order, like how long am I going to live to like, Let's get a puppy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, let's get a dog. Let's get a pet. <laughs> Funny, bro. Isn't Google supposed to know everything? Nah, Google's a little incompetent sometimes. Okay, next one. Short English story, Google Translate. Uh, oh my God, not the, not the Jinx chapter again, bro. I thought this was League of Legends when I put this in. Where is Florida? Okay. Thank you, next bit life. Not the bit life. Diva Overwatch. Niji Ian in Sims 4. Where does Ed Sharon live? And then an address in London. Uh, you trying to you trying to stock Ed Sharon, bro? I guarantee. Okay, listen. You know what? This might be me being um this might be me pontificating. But my thing is, I think they Googled where does Ed Sharon live? And then they got 
the answer an english address so they googled an english address or an, an, an address in london thinking that that was his address and then in reality it was not and maybe even even crazier theory maybe the person who googled this is esl so they didn't actually google it in english but then when they got the answer it was in english so they just immediately copy pasted the answer instead of like looking into what the fuck it meant that's like a crazy theory but i i think it could potentially be true that's the only way it makes sense the only way it's just a theory a kill theory and then they just looked up like different characters and stuff honestly everything else in this isn't that isn't that crazy except apparently you know jinxes apparently that's crazy i assume perfect love the bad new wife of sweet chapter 411 is crazy too you know just given the context clues um everything else is fine i think i'm trying to learn anatomy ao3 do dragons have two pp anatomy this is what you call an anatomy do dragons have two peepees anatomy are you drawing dragon nsfw art like why why do you need to know no 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 seriously why do you need to know huh i feel like when most people draw dragons or animals they aren't like looking at how to you know clearly draw their genitals you know i'm just saying and then they looked up an AO3 thing after that. Oh my God. You're into dragons. That's crazy. We figured it out. Apparently, Nuet Village is, is, is a dragon in Genshin. Okay, so then you Googled from that, do dragons have two peepees? Because I guess Nuetville was making you feel something. You're like, ooh, Nuetville, this Genshin character, you know, he kind of, he kind of, you know, fine, he a fine thing or whatever. And then so you were like, ooh, I wonder, does he have two peepees? So then you Googled it because you were curious. And then after that, you Googled AO3 because you're like, damn, now I'm in the mood to read some fan fiction about dragons having two peepees. You didn't even skip a beat. You went straight to AO3 after Googling this shit. I see you. I see you. I, I see you. You're not hiding shit from me, okay? I understand. I understand what you did. You're not hiding it from me. Or they're writing a story about... Or they're writing a story about how dragons have two peepees about this Genshin character. You're welcome. Detective Kyo cracked the case. Once again, I know. I know, I know, I know. I'm crazy. You know, I got that. Buffman Anatomy, Vem, Denim Comics, bright white screen. Okay. Yeah, no, I think, I think maybe you're, maybe you're a writer. Maybe you draw the art illustrations for your AO3 stuff. Can you add pictures on AO3? I don't even know. But the top three searches are wild, bro. Like, they, these told a story. These told a whole story, man. I knew exactly what the fuck you did. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Okay, I know you're a, you're a monster fucker. Okay? You like you like that, the, the dragon dongers, okay? It's okay. Not even that, you like the double dragon dongers. The triple D. Sheesh. Triple D is crazy. <laughs> All right, next one. I think I was drunk. I don't remember searching half of this. <laughs> yeah, bro, you were drunk. Look at these. Look at these. What does it mean when my mom was half with the... the, the, the Okay, yeah. Zerom the ape the non games. Yeah, okay. Why is my houndroid burning oven? Okay. Bug I think we're trying to search bug fables. Bug fabric. Okay, yeah. 
Whip is threats my spleen. Maybe your spleen hurt. I'm not too sure. Um, this looks like Romanized Japanese. So I think I don't think you were drunk here, okay? I, I don't think the the you looked up AI, the solemn files. I don't think you were drunk for that. The thing you looked up in Japanese Romanji, I don't think you were drunk with that. Then I guess you got a little bit lit. Maybe it was Thanksgiving. I don't really know. Then you started Googling, you know, something about your spleen, bug fables. Why is your something burning? Okay. Then something about zero something games. Then some about your mom. And then afterward, in perfect English, you're like, true alpha. I'm not really sure what that means, but. Shout out to you, man. You know? Hey, some people drunk text their ex. Some people drunk Google search. You know, and personally, I think drunk Google searching is a better option. Maybe you don't have an ex to drunk text. So, um, damn, that's kind of sad. Nah. But you know what? I still think drunk Google searching is more productive. You know, maybe you'll learn something. You know? Better than drunk texting your ex. <laughs> Bro, is this supposed to say, why is my house burning down? I don't really know. Like, I'm trying to figure it out. Did you like, did you make like fucking instant noodles and not put water in that, in the bitch? You know, my sister d used to do that shit all the time. And like one time, like we had to fucking like air out the house and shit. Cause like, it was like a fuck, like the microwave was smoking, bro. It was smoking. You say you did it as well? I didn't do that. I put a brownie in the microwave one time and it started smoking, which made no fucking sense because the brownie was just on like a microwavable plate. But it caught on fire. I don't know if the brownie was too greasy or what the fuck happened, but the brownie caught on fire. I put it in the microwave for like 20 seconds and a dead ass caught on fire. I'm so serious. I don't know how the fuck it caught on fire. I don't know, man. Twenty's a lot. Twenty seconds for a brownie is not a lot at all. Was it dry? No, it was very greasy. Would you put in them brownies? I bought it from like a store. I bought it from like a like a bakery. All right, next one. Peppa Pig height. Krispy Kreme, Beatles, fan fiction mean, Wigs, Vox, Akuma, and Tamagotchi. This is the most random shit. This is the most random shit. What the fuck? Peppa Pig height. Wasn't there a meme that Peppa Pig was like six foot at one point? Is she actually six foot? That's terrifying if she is. Maybe she saw your family cooking and thought there was a fire going on when she was drunk. I don't know, bro. But like... I don't know how the brown... I do not know how the brownie caught on fire, though. I actually don't. Like, to this day, I don't know how it caught on fire. And those of you asking why I microwave the brownie is because I wanted the brownie to be warm, you know? Like, I brought it home from, like, this bakery slash restaurant and, like, it was used, it was warm at first and then it got cold. Maybe she's that friend that Googles everything. Word! You, you know how there's always that person in the friend group that just, like, Googles shit whenever anyone, like, wants to know something or they get in a debate about something? There's always that one person that's like, okay, I'll Google it. And then they fucking Google that shit. There's always one person. There always is. You are so right. I didn't even think about that. Maybe they're the Google friend. Why is that me? I'm gonna tell you right now, I am not that friend. I am too fucking lazy. I'm like, alright, you wanna Google this? Word? Google it yourself, stupid. I'm like, I'm tired. 
I'm exhausted. I don't have the energy. You know, and I could easily pull out my phone and Google it and it would take like five minutes, but I real, real deal just don't feel like it. So I'm not going to. <laughs> I'm the problem. I'm sorry. Guys, it's like, it's too much work. I'm lazy. I got arthritis in my fingers, you know? I don't want to. Fuck that. Fuck every part of that. Takes like 20 seconds? I know, bro. How to grow taller? Chibi Kyokonico. Kyokonico midriff. Which is lighter? One kilogram of iron or one kilogram of cotton? Chat, which one's lighter? I mean, they're both one kilogram, but I mean, I'm just curious. Like, which one's lighter, though? Because I don't really know. <laughs> I love how the first person in chat's like, oh, they're stupid. <laughs> Yo, chill out, bro. Yo, you know that, but like realistically, if someone asked you, like, you know, what's lighter, a pound of bricks or a pound of feathers, a lot of people just say feathers by default. Because like it's the feathers are less dense. So you just think of them as like lighter by default. You know what I'm saying? But they are the same. Because steel is heavier than feathers. Yeah, also steel is heavier than feathers. Like, if they were the same size object, right? Like, if they were, like, made into, like, density cubes out of the materials, the steel would always be heavier. So, you kind of think of it, like, by default, like, oh, steel is typically heavier. Like, if we had, like, the, a steel that would fit in, like, this space versus steel that a feather that would fit in this space, like, the steel would probably be heavier. And that's true. But it's still the same. You know? Like, if you had one con ball or one steel sized or one con ball sized piece of steel, the steel is going to be heavier. They're like, oh, that's that's how my brain defaults. Which part of the body did philosophers believe house the soul? I feel like most people say it's the heart, right? I don't know. This is pretty normal, though. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. He thinks we're stupid. I'm just talking about my thought process. Okay? Yeah, no chat. You're stupid. My, my fault. My fault. I can't believe I expect you guys to be intelligent. It's crazy. Which is heavier, my body or my mom's expectations? <laughs> the theory is the soul is in the back of the neck. What? I shout out to that. Gabby, thanks so much for the super chat. I think I'm in my honey bun X microwave era. Bro, I think, I don't know if a microwave honey bun would be good, but I don't think it would be bad. All right, don't now don't judge the victim here. These are some questionable things in my search history. No, not November, the complete series. No, not November, 2023. <laughs> Sorry, what, what was that? The, the no, not November? You, you trying to find the no, not November, 2023 edition series? Well, let me tell you where you can buy the full collection. You know, I got the whole collection here, the full series. You know, all 32 books of the No No November series. You know, at your discretion, whenever you need it, okay? I will actually sell you them in a bundle deal for $29.99 USD. That's right, $29.99 USD. And if you buy the No Nut November complete series before November is over, we'll even give you a complimentary a complimentary tango with your order so that once known that November is over, you can finally release all of that pent up frustration. So don't forget it. If you would like the No Not November complete series, it is $29.99. Thank you so much for listening to this advert. What the fuck? <laughs>
What? Do I get freebies? I just told you you got freebies. I'll take 20? Yo, what the fuck is this ad? I mean, what the fuck is this Google search? No, not November complete series. Like, what you what you mean what you mean by that? What what you, what you mean by that? All right, next one. I think they failed on November. I think they did too. Okay, Pet Petra Society was me actually trying to open this one particular website. What? He <laughs> he. I don't know what you talking about. I'm going to act like I don't know. Da 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 da. Okay. Fentanyl, fen fen fentanyl carbonite function when mixed with vanillin. Trauma score, millisecond to second proteins functional group. Does philosome inhibiting glucose absorption. Are you like a bio major? You, you in chemistry? You in chemistry. Are you a chem student? Is that why you're looking at petrol society? Like petroleum society? You trying to be a chemical engineer? That's my theory. That's my theory. And then you were like, uh, you know, AO3 because, well, you know, why not? Smart people scare me. What's wrong with smart people? What's wrong with smart people? Okay, next one. My search history is pretty wholesome. Celsius to Fahrenheit. Ma Pets, London Weather, Adobe Express, Cats.com, Cat Carrier, Cat Carrier for Vet, Fast Cheesecake. Oh my God, your your shit is wholesome. This is like a fucking like chill ass Zen person's search history. What the fuck? This is so normal. My God, why do you watch my content? Are you okay? Am I like your? Am I like the only unnormal thing in your life? Like, this is... I feel like I'm, like, gonna make you worse. You might need to find someone else to, to, to watch. I don't know about all this. Oh, I don't know about... I don't know about all this sort of... This, this stuff right here. I don't know about... About all this stuff right here. Someone said, maybe they're a rosebud. True! Wait, if they're a rosebud, why he watch? Are you okay? Why are you why are you now a kill me? Did something happen? If you if you need help, you can tell me. Or don't. What are some VTuber recommendations for normal people? Shit, I don't know. I have none. The fuck? The fuck? I have none! None for you! No normal recommendations. You're corrupted. If you're here, you're corrupted. It's too late. It's, we've already taken hold. Um, You can't get rid of the virus. I feel like I actually appeal to normies. I'm not gonna lie. But like, normie does not mean normal. Like, let, let's get one thing clear. Okay? Normie does not mean normal. Like, I appeal to people that don't, that aren't into the VTuber culture stuff, right? However, that doesn't mean I appeal to level-headed individuals, okay? Let's get one thing clear. Y'all motherfuckers are crazy like I am. However, I do have the most normie style appeal or like non-VTuber fan appeal, but like not level-headed individuals, okay? That's, that's the different thing, you know? You know? <laughs> I don't know, actually. Okay, I would say shoe appeals to level-headed individuals, but I feel like when when the streamer themselves is super level-headed, I feel like sometimes the audience is like not as level-headed because they like watch them to feel more stable. You know what I'm saying? 
not to say that applies to the minions but i'm saying like i haven't i'm not familiar enough to make that judgment i don't know though because like realistically if i was to watch Shu, i wouldn't watch Shu um if i was similar to him i don't think the part of the reason why i like Shu is because we're so different you know he's like very like I watch him and I feel like less insane for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Why did your vocabulary suddenly skyrocket? That happens when I start explaining things that are more complicated. I don't know, man. My vocabulary is like non-existent until I like have to start explaining something that's slightly complicated. And then my vocabulary like 10 X is within the span of two seconds. I don't know. Then when I start talking about random bullshit, it goes back to me sounding like someone who fucking blurts out slang and repeats words i don't know just happens it's fucked up easier to forget kills a weave every time he pronounces a japanese word okay I'm not gonna lie, I've gotten to the point where I just stopped trying to pronounce them. Because like, I feel more embarrassed if I try and it's wrong than if I don't try and it's wrong. If I don't try, at least I know I didn't try, so I don't give a fuck when y'all clown me. But the thing is, if I do try, it's like, damn, I put in all this effort and I still took a public L? Fuck that. So at this point, I'm, I'm in the stage of like, you're gonna make fun of me either way, so I'm just gonna not try, you know? Because why? <laughs> or I say it like it's a Spanish word and then y'all are like, well, it's still wrong, stupid. And I'm like, damn. But yeah, like, I don't know, man. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, I'm gonna use the bathroom. Okay, give me one. Give me, give me one second. Un momento. I will be right back. All right, I'm back. Here to continue my judgment. All right, next one. Whisker signals. I don't know what that means. Lotto, lotto. I don't know what that means either. Wolverine hail. Okay. Some characters wallet pelvic floor exercises without equipment drip anime girl with tiger suit i'm confused ah Like,
I don't. I just feel like Okay It just Like none of these Make any sense together You know, and also, guys, all I'm saying is if this was Googled first, okay, the, the pelvic floor exercises, and then the lotto lotto, I ain't saying nothing, but there could be a multi use function for the lotto lotto, you know, I'm just saying. Also, what are whisker signals? No, 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 let me cook though. Like, it makes sense. It makes sense. Listen, y'all are saying it's two balls attached to a string, okay? It could happen. Whisker signals are for cats. Wait, do cats give off signals based off of their like their whiskers? Their clackers. Okay, I'll just say ball with the string. I don't really know other than that. To be honest. Boop, 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 boop. Only probably has a crush on a girl who's into tigers and searched up clothes and workout plans and a hairstyle from Wolverine or Huge Jackman. Okay. It's not that kind of toy. Well, no, I know. Lot of Loki, I thought that shit was like ice cream though. Boop, 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 boop. That should sound like a dessert. Maybe it's because it sounds like gelato. Guys, this mine was in the gutter. Wait, I want to look at what this looks like. This is like that one toy where you like do the thing with the, um, you know the toy, I, what the fuck is it called? You have to like try to like catch it on the, um, that like little like stick with the ball on the string. I don't know what that shit's called. That much of those. That shit would hurt, bro. Because, like, if you miss, like, the fucking big-ass wooden ball just smacks your hand. And you're like, ow. Like, what the fuck? Should be hurting. Very shit clips. Thanks for the five months. Ashley Alouette. Thanks for the 14. Thank you. 
Now, low key though, pelvic exercises or pelvic floor exercises sometimes are used if like you have like trouble shitting too. Ba 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 ba. And you would know because, uh, I don't know. I just be knowing shit. I'm like a medical, I'm like a medical disaster, bro. I just know shit. I just, you pick up shit when you're like in the fucking hospital for like years, you know? Alright, next one. Why does my cat electric towards cover? Why does my cat's tail fluff up when I pet her? Snake emoji. Synonym. What's the best kind of shampoo for 4C hair? Miku figurines. Dark synonym. What's it mean when the muscle is bigger than usual from pain and flame muscles? Damn, bro. You got a lot going on. No, Loki, this is kind of a normal search history, though, too. So you have a pet cat. You have 4C hair. And you had inflamed muscles at one point. And you're either a writer or you had to do something where you needed to use fancier words for like a school thing. Only writers be looking up synonyms like this. Da, 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 da. All right, next one. Josh Hutcherson x Kyo Konica. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Whoa, 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 what you mean? Hello? Ch chat? Nah. The meme was enough, man. Okay, you can leave it at that. Lethal dose of caramel apples. How much caramel apples did you eat? Where does it hurt when appendicitis? Yo, the amount of times I've Googled this is crazy. Yo, every time I get a sharp pain in like my lower abdomen area, I'm like, oh, fuck, man. My appendix about to explode. I'm like, shit. I'm like, really, bro? After all my issues? Like, please. Like, please, bro. Not, not this, goddammit. Not this, too. And I start like Googling, like, where is the appendix located? I swear. Like every time, bro. I have like a sharp pain for like a few hours there. That's like really bad. And I'm like, damn. The last one. How to not look like a 10-year-old at 18. <laughs> You're fucked. Okay, it, ha it happened to me too, man. Okay, I looked, I looked like a 10-year-old for like, you know, a long time until the moon unfroze me. So, you know, it, it can happen. Okay, you know, it, it just... It is what it is. Is what it is. Puberty hits some people like a truck, and puberty, you know, just um, you know, uh, you know, does a little dance, and you know, fucking sometimes, you know, your your body hormones they parry the puberty, so it just doesn't happen. I don't know what to say. All right, next one. It Kyo Kaneko is cringe or not? You you have to Google that to find out. Like you can't come up with your own opinion. Like you need someone else to tell you. You need Google to tell you. You need Google to tell you if I'm cringe. Like you can't just decide. Like you can't just like think critically yourself. You can't determine the answer yourself. Hello? Vox Akuma ASMR Archive. I 
okay bro i know you be on that office rp shit you know you can't hide from me too much longer we we know about that shit okay we know you gotta be on the desk at eight o'clock or whatever the fuck the title was at one point i don't remember but yeah that's that shit okay all right you fiending for the asmr i mean he did give y'all time before he removed them he's like i'm removing them soon so you know he he gave y'all time to um save them or whatever why is my luck so bad mood why does Vera vermilion rar so funny why does Vera vermilion rar <laughs> i don't know why does Vera vermilion rar that's like the the most infer the 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 only thing i know about Vera that's like just random as fuck is that he roars like that's like and i hear this more than anything else about the poor man like yo that or like i just see him flirting with people on twitter like sometimes i'll see like him randomly respond to someone with some like oddly flirty comment that just seems like way out of left field and i'm like where the I'm like, where's the Vera that I see on stream? That like, where that like, where is this coming from? Just like how on the button show, he went wild. I was like, hello. I was like, bro, do you have this in you? I had no idea. Ryan, thanks for super chat. I'm unfortunately not gonna read your message, but um, I appreciate it. And Shiggy, thanks for super chat. You are a Vox Akuma ASMR. Enjoy your two kill. You are one of us. Yo, like, I'm I'm not though. But you know, it's okay. If 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 you think I'm one of you and that makes you feel less alone, you can feel that way. You know, it's okay. I I completely understand, you know. Sometimes you want your Oshi to share your interests. And you know, if they don't, you know, you can just pretend they do to make yourself feel better. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, you know what goes on in the office RP then? Yo, like the whole branch knew what happened in the office RP. What you mean? Everyone knows. If you don't know, I feel like you're just like not in Niji Sanji, you know? I feel like the viewers even know and they don't even, they probably all probably didn't even watch it. You just know. You know? Okay, Tesla stock crash, disadvantages of stock investing. For instance, synonym, Hawkeye synonym, star rail pity counter. Translate, is the word, is the word this formal? There is synonym, there, there is academic system. Okay, are you like a fucking, are you like doing like investment banking too, bro? Is you like an accounting major? You're, you're doing some business degree. You're doing some business degree. That's for damn sure. I don't know. I don't know what what business degree you're doing, but you're doing some business degree. All right, next one. I forgot half of these. What is the MBTI is serial killers? Okay. Kirby Deskmat, normal. I don't know who Will Afton is. Google Drive, AirPods Pro. Why do I always wait for my loved one to comfort me? Wh huh? What is a woman's um spot and Um, well, I love how we went from what's a woman's spot to, um, what's the MBTI or mo of most serial killers? <laughs> what you, what you mean by that? Huh? <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, that's crazy. Someone said asking the important questions. You know what? Some people need to know, okay? You know, um, 
Low key though, I am curious what is the MBTI of most serial killers. But to be honest, I don't remember anything about the MBTI, so I don't even know what mine is. Like, I don't even know what the INFPJEIJKLMNPQRSTUV. I don't know what any of them letters mean. I don't remember. I don't fucking remember. I have no recollection. I took the test once before in pre debut because everyone in Aluna did it. And I know it's like a personality test, but I don't know what the fuck the numbers and shit mean. But. You know, um, yeah. My God, I'm an INFP. Yeah, that's the only one I ever hear. People are like, I'm an INFP. I'm an introvert. That's all I ever hear, bro. Or like INFJ. Those are the only two I know, and I don't even know what the fuck they mean. I don't know what any of the letters mean. I just know that's a thing, and people say it all the time. Like, I'm an INFP. Me too. <laughs> and I'm like, what the fuck does that mean, you know? Like, you have to, like, study and remember what all of the things mean to know what the letters and stuff mean. And I, like, don't care enough to know, you know? I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm like, ah, here's what it is. Yo, this is the most wild shit, bro. What the fuck? This one is crazy, though. I mean, uh, shout out to you. You know, at least you're doing your research or some shit. At least you're doing your research. Okay, Nendroid, Character AI, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Amplify, Renzoto Lyrics, Chat GPT, 100 Digits of Pi, and Kill Kaneko. Amplify! It's a spark between you and I on Character AI. That's you. Okay, we're gonna talk about the one plus one. Yeah, it's okay, bro. They forgot the calculator app, you know? <laughs> Yo, I'm not gonna lie. People that Google like math questions, I'm like, bro, I'm like, just download a calculator app, man. Because normally when you Google math questions, like Google just, it doesn't help. Okay, like, and also, how you not know what one plus one is? What the fuck? How, I'm surprised you even know how to spell. How did you even type any of these words, bro? Where, there's no spelling errors, but you like can't, you don't know what one plus one is? That's crazy. That is crazy. Me, whenever I'm stressed from math, bruh. Okay. Why is Kyo? Why is my nipple wonky? Do trees have penges? I don't know what that means. I mean, if you're trying to censor it, why are you censoring it to Google? You think Google can't handle a, 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 a nasty word? Cat, my ankle hurts. Sag, how to get rid of dyslexia? I don't even know what the fuck that means. Best dinner, Genshin Cold Redeem. What's the time? I ain't gonna lie, Google, Googling what's the time is crazy. <laughs> like, you can't look at the clock on your fucking device. Every device has a clock in the bottom corner or the home screen or the top corner. But you out here Googling the fucking time. You typed what's the time. That's crazy. That is crazy, bro. That is crazy. Why is my nipple wonky is also crazy. I mean, you know what? Shout out to you for trying to figure it out. Um, you know, you, you know, sometimes you know, a wonky nipple could be like, you know, like uh the the some this indication that you might have some underlying health problems. So you know, at least you're making sure you're healthy and well. But then my question is, why immediately after that did you search why is kill? Like, what do I have to do with the wonky nipple? I just, I just. I just have a question. Like, I don't know how long the spacing was in between those two searches, but I mean, the fact that you typed why is twice makes me think you typed them after each other. So like, why am I after that? Like, why did you think of me next? You know, that's my question. Like, why did you go from, why is my nipple wonky to, why is Kyo kind of, like what, uh, hello? Uh, why, why did your wonky nipple remind you of me? What does that mean? Should I be offended? Should I be like, like f uh, flattered? Like, 
What does it mean? How am I supposed to take this information? How? Like, imagine someone walks up to you. Damn, bro, you remind me of my wonky nipple. Like, what? What the fuck does that mean? Like, yo. I'd be like, okay. Uh, all right. Yeah. Thanks for the, the information. Um, now I know you got a wonky nipple. And on top of that, I know um, I remind you of said wonky nipple. Like, bruh. 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 That's crazy. That is crazy. Also, do trees have peepees? Bro, do you know how do you know how plants work? Hello? I don't I don't even know like what you know what? I'm just going to move on. I don't know. I just don't know how to feel about the, the wonky nipple kill Conico. Like, I really, like, like, personally, like, I'm just, like, I'm a little, I'm oddly, I'm oddly offended, but, like, also, like, oddly not offended. Like, I'm more intrigued. Like, what was going through your mind? Like, I wish I could read your mind and play by play what got you to search one thing after the other and, like, what caused said thing to like think you know like what the fuck <sighs> atrenus <laughs> atrenus is crazy bro okay ka of acetic acid and yo you searching fucking like ke like chemistry formulas <laughs> i love how there's like they're like searching chemistry formulas and then randomly, there's just like, what do you call a bagel without a hole? Like, <laughs> what? Yo, they're like, PA of uh, uh, acetic acid. Um, Does blood pressure affect pH? Percent of error. How close is your pH supposed to be to the target pH? What is the change in pH when given, measured, and calculated pH? What do you call a bagel without a hole? Na2CO3. KH of acetic acid. Like, what? I don't know. A bagel... A bun? Like, they were thinking about pH and then randomly they were like, damn, bro, I wonder what the fuck you call a bagel without a hole. You know, I, I this is such a pressing matter that you, fuck, fuck my chemistry homework. I need to real quick look up what is a bagel without a hole called? And then they found out and they were like, okay, now back to my chemistry. Um, so anyways, the formula NaCO3, Um, what about this? Like, Yo. Am I gonna lie? Sometimes when I was doing homework, I would do the same thing. I'd be like randomly doing some work and then suddenly I just think of something else and I'm like, this is a more pressing issue in the in my mind. Although it's actually less pressing. I do want to look this up first. And then you do it and then you're like, oh, okay. And then like, cause like it's one of those things you just keep thinking about it. Like she was probably, they were probably doing like the blood pressure and percent of error. And in the back of their mind, they're like, damn, bagel without a hole. And they just couldn't come up with the answer. So they just had to Google it so they could move on. They couldn't move past it until they Googled it. You know what I'm saying? Like it's that one thing in the back of your head that you're just thinking about, thinking about, thinking about. And you're like, fuck, okay, fine. I'll just look it up. So that you finally move the fuck on. Someone said a safe for work bagel. <laughs> A, 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 a safe for work, a child friendly bagel, a PG bagel, a E for everyone. Why the hell is there a name for that? Is there? That is someone who has control over their ADHD. On God. All right, next one. What is Luca Kanashiro's NSFW? Hey, yo. Oh, you just, just publicly, you just publicly exposing yourself, man. You just, <laughs> you just publicly exposing yourself. You're like, well, fuck it. You know, I'm gonna just post this on Twitter publicly. Um, It's the fact that you Googled it. And then we're like, I'm gonna post this. Cause why the fuck not? The self-report is crazy, bro. The self-report is crazy. How do people die in their sleep? 
How do we go from how do people die in their sleep to Luka Kaneshiro NSFW tag? The human mind is amazing, bro. They Google how to die in your sleep, and then they went, what is Luka Kaneshiro's NSFW tag? That's crazy. That is crazy. That's wild. Shout out to the human brain. You had a day. All right, next one. Botox hair treatment meaning... Wait, Botox hair treatment is a thing? Doesn't Botox paralyze your muscles? Fettuccine pronounce Facebook. My awful ruined my daughter's birthday. My awful niece pushed my daughter. You Googled some like formula or coordinates. What the fuck? Okay, this is, this is a story, bro. My awful niece pushed my daughter. My awful ruined my daughter's birthday. Your niece is a menace. Your niece is a menace. That's what I know. Okay, your niece did some fuck shit to your daughter. I don't know what they did. You have a daughter and your, your niece was a menace. Your niece ruined the birthday party. My question is, why did you Google it? That doesn't make sense. It's like you're writing it like it's a diary. And then they went to Facebook to rant about it. <laughs> yeah, then they went to Facebook afterward to like rant about it. You know? They're like, ah, oh, fuck it. My, my fucking dog shit ass niece ruined my fucking great daughter's birthday. And then they got so stressed about it, they lost hair. So they needed to get Botox hair treatment. Damn, bro. That's crazy. I can't believe your awful niece ruined your daughter's birthday so much that you stressed, typed it on Facebook, and then had to get hair replacement treatment because you lost so much hair due to this pure amount of rage and stress. Shout out to you. Okay, next one. Okay, am I the only person who hates? Yo, okay. not This font isn't the one that pisses me off. But there's a font that a lot of people use. I don't know if this is an Android thing or what. But, like, people will use fonts that just are not the default ones that are just so inconvenient to read. Like so inconvenient to read like the net the cursive looking one why the fuck do people use that that is the most annoying shit to read and look at like why like it looks terrible and it's so hard to read i feel like when i look at it i'm like damn i gotta think about what i'm reading like three times harder than normal Every time someone sends me a screenshot with that font, I look at it like, uh, uh, what the fuck, you know? I don't know. I also, I don't think they look good. You know, I don't know. I, I hate, I hate them. Those fonts. This is fine. This font's chill though. Yo, Konako, hoodie, DIY, Paranoia, League of Legends, okay. Aikuma, okay, we got a shipper. Suica game on PC. Butt slapping game. Handsome dude, butt slapping game. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I see you. I see you. I see you. I know exactly what the fuck you're talking about, too. I saw that shit on Twitter. Don't act like I don't know. I saw that shit on Twitter. You know, someone... <laughs> I'm not going to say who. Someone in, in EN was, like, asking one of the managers if we could play that. <laughs> like, can we play this on stream? <laughs> and the managers were like, bro. Why are you asking us this question? Like, what do you think the answer is? They were like, what do you think the answer is? They put like a laughing emoji and they were like, okay. <laughs> I 
And then I had some other people reacted to it in the, in the like the text channel. We're like, LMAO, please, 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 man is saying, we want to play this. There were like four people that like responded. They were like, please. And then I think like someone else underneath it was like, oh my God, no, you didn't, bitch. Like, no, you know, you didn't ask for this. It was so funny. There were like four people underneath it that were like, please. And then like, no, you didn't. There's no way you asked that shit. It was so funny. Guys, I'm not telling you who said it. That's the, the, the if I tell you someone, that means I'm not going to tell you, you know? I feel like I can explain these, but at the same time, I don't want to. Okay, my girlfriend cheated with my best friend, so I ruined both of their lives at once. My parents chose their new family over me. Are these like those like weird like Reddit stories? I hope so. Because otherwise, you're just like writing, you know, a diary about your telenovela of a life in the fucking Google search, you know? They're addictive, bro. Loki, I used to be like obsessed with those Reddit, like, like, like Reddit thread shits. I know what you're talking about, bro. It was like crazy Reddit stories. Okay. Is lead contact poison or injecting poison? Okay. Certain different paints. I just select all hair in Vroid Studio. Perfect sync, natural color iPhone 15 Pro Max. So you like to make Vroid models. Okay. You are a Yaminian. And on top of that, you touched lead and were paranoid that you got poisoned. I don't know if I've ever touched like pure lead before. You know, when I was a little kid, I used to be scared that like the fucking graphite from pencils was like poisonous. I remember one time I like stabbed it into my hand on accident and then I like went up to my mom and I was like all scared I was going to die. And she was kind of like, bro, like don't stab yourself with a pencil, but like you're going to be fine. And I was like, but isn't it lead? And she's like, not really. It's graphite, but like don't worry about it. Just don't do it again. And I was like, okay. <laughs> they were like, okay. I was paranoid though. Or there were those fucking dumbass kids that would like sniff Sharpies and shit. Nah, the Sharpie sniffing kids were crazy, bro. I don't know what it was, bro, but they were like. Everyone had one of those kids or those kids in the fucking lunch, the cafeteria that would like pour their milk and random sauces on their food, mix it together and then eat it and like think that it didn't gross everyone else out. Those motherfuckers too, man. I swear we all knew one of these kids. There was the food mixers in the cafeteria. Okay. That mixed everything and thought they were like, you know, Thought we wouldn't find it nasty. There were the Sharpie sniffers. And then there were like the, the, the lead graphite stabbers. We all had at least one of those or all of them. Oh, and the kid that shred up erasers. That motherfucker too. The eraser cutter kids were the, were the ones that I was scared were going to stab me in class. They got the er er erase, eraser cutters too. Oh, and the eraser stabbers. That shit too. Stop, that was me. I'm just saying, bro. The eraser cutters are always the ones that you gotta look out for. You know? I'm just I'm just saying. Ah. 
I was the I was a proud eraser stabber. Nah, that's crazy. Okay, next one. Niji Petit Volume 1 A. A. Okay. Niji Store. How to tell if my dog is pregnant. If I ate bark, what would happen? My poop is green. Why is my shit green? Why is my poop green? Why you got like seven websites trying to determine if your shit is green? <laughs> You got, why is my poop green? Why is my poop green? Why is my shit green? Why is my poop green when I didn't? Like, yo, it's okay. Sometimes your poop is just green. Don't overthink it. Okay, it's not that serious. You might, you probably just ate something with more chlorophyll in it or something, bro. Like, <laughs> ah. why is my shit green is wild, bro. They were paranoid. They were really trying to figure out why their shit was green. And then they were like, maybe it's the tree bark I ate. And then this like, if I ate bark, what would happen? And then they have a pregnant dog on top of that. Damn, your dog's pregnant. Your poop is green and you ate tree bark. That's a lot going on, bro. That is a lot going on. That is, that is a lot going on, bro. Damn. Hey, damn. You're... You got a lot going on. I don't, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> I just love how they had like, like fucking like, not just like, they didn't look it up once. They didn't look it up twice, but like four times. And then they went from like, why is my poop green? To like, maybe I should search, why is my shit green? And then they're like, okay, maybe I should search, why is my poop green? If or when this. They were, they really wanted to know, bro. They really wanted to know. Anyone know why? Well, it can be green for a multitude of reasons, you know? All right, next one. AO3, risque meaning tailbone. How to switch account on Google Chrome. Okay. English to Japanese, color hunt. How to make a Google account. I don't even know how to fucking pronounce that pronunciation. I love how they Googled, like, how to make a Google account. I don't know why. Some of that's like oddly ironic. Like on Google, asking Google how to use its own website. Like, yo, Google, how do I use Google? Well, I think Google would know best, you know? Word. I did that once. Yo, I'm not going to lie. I've probably done some shit like that too. Yo, you know, you want to know what my mom does sometimes? They'll Google like google.com on their phone. And I'm like, bro, you know, Google's the default search engine of your browser, right? You don't have to Google google.com. And my mom was like, but I want to use Google. I'm like, but like, if you type anything into this bar, it uses Google. And my mom was like, but that's not google.com. And I'm like, but like it, it sources through Google. Like it'll send it to Google for you. So like it, it, it routes to Google. And she was like, what do you mean? I'm like, bro, like, just type it in here and it'll do the same thing. Like, it defaults to Google. So funny. I think because back in the day, I don't know if this is like my mom's like uh, back in the day. I don't know if it was Internet Explorer or what. Didn't it used to like default to like Yahoo or something? So maybe my mom's like, you know, trying to not use Yahoo. But I'm like, bro, like now most things either default to Google or you can change the default, right? What if you use Safari? Safari goes through Google too. Safari's default search engine is Google most of the time. Yeah, it was Yahoo or Bing. Yeah. All right, next one. Okay, what goes first? Serum, moisturizer or serum? Skincare. Okay, you're you you got you're trying to keep up with your good skin. Yuri, not Doki Doki Literature Club, but Yuri. Okay, you're into Yuri. Okay, you like AO3 and you like to read, you know, uh, you like to read the fan fiction. So you're, you're, in my opinion, I'm going to say you're a, you're a Fujoshi that is trying to have a good skincare routine or yeah, you know, getting into skincare. That's my, that's my theory. That's all I know about you though. That's it. 
you know? The fact that half a chat knows what you're talking about just proves my point. See? See? Who does run to Yaoi, not Yuri? What the fuck is the term for that? Shit, I don't know. Okay. You're a, of a similar light, just different gender, um, dif different gender love, um, and skincare. Okay, next. Mine's pretty chill, I think. Do frogs do backflips for fun? Okay. How do I explain arrow ace to old people? I have the answer for you. You give up. Uh <laughs> is it illegal to hit someone else's child? Is it okay to call someone else's child ugly? How to make five-year-olds shut up? What did this five-year-old do to you? What the fuck did this five-year-old kid do to you? Why, why do you have beef with a, with some random five-year-old that's not your kid? Like, why do you have beef with some five-year-old kid, bro? They're five, man. They're five. They're five. Okay, how to make your five-year-old shut up is valid. How to call someone else's kid? Is it okay to call someone else's kid ugly? Like, why do you need to Google that? You know the answer, stupid. And then they're like, they go from, okay, how do I make this kid shut up to, okay, if I call this kid ugly, is it fucked up? And then from that, they're like, is it illegal for me to hit this kid? Like, we went from like zero to a thousand in three Google searches. What the fuck? Yo, they want validation. Yeah, they just want to make sure like, you know, they want someone on, on like, they want one person on like Reddit or some random fucking Quora or like Ask Me site to agree with them so that they feel justified in fucking calling someone else's kid ugly. That is crazy. That is crazy, bro. That is crazy. You know what? If you don't like being around kids, you know, just don't be around them. You, you know? I think they wanted confirmation. I love how he went from Uki to metronome to can dogs have shrimp to yo, this five year old motherfucker. And then they're like, oh, how do I backflip? Okay. Well, do frogs backflip? <laughs> Maybe this was they were at Thanksgiving dinner, you know? Maybe that's what it was. Maybe one of their like baby cousins or something was irritating the shit out of them. Maybe this was this had to be like some family reunion shit. For sure. This had to be some family reunion shit. For sure, bro. 100%. 100%. Just out of my search. Is that okay? I'm not, I already have like the... I already selected all of them. I'm not taking any more submissions. Sorry. My apologies. What if you live with kids because they're siblings? Okay, well, if you live with your siblings, like, you don't have to ask if it's okay to call them ugly. You're just going to do it anyways. Be for real. What sibling has ever Googled, is it okay if I call my younger sibling ugly? You've never done that. You just called them ugly or you didn't. Be for real. Be honest with yourself. You're not going to Google to see if it's okay. You're either going to do it or you're not going to do it. Okay? Like, let's be honest. All right? You just did it. <laughs> I never once in my life Googled, is it okay if I fight with my sister? No, it just happened. You know? It just happened. There's no holding back. Yeah. All right, next one. UPS, can't link art in Discord. Legs cramping all the time. Mood. Tax brackets 2023. Shit, I don't even want to think about that. Pop flex. Sean Kingston hits. Uh, 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 uh. Why you want to go away from home? Love. Why you leave me? Why? why? Sorry. <laughs> Let's buy saying some note 20 ultra screen projector. Okay. Reaper scans. What is a pab test? Rome. How to buy tickets for event at Anime Impulse OC. Low blood pressure. Damn, bro. 
Your shit just be everywhere. You got like some medical shit. Okay, buying tickets at Anime Impulse. I see you. Um, Googling some Black Friday sales ahead of time. Tax brackets I don't want to think about. I'm going to be tax planning already. Yo, I stop, guys. You're stressing me out. I don't want to think about it. Stop. No taxes. I don't want to think about it. I don't want to think about it at all. I bet. It's okay. I have till April. I've literally filed an extension like every year. I swear to God. All right, next one. Why are anime guys so attractive? How to get someone to like you? Why am I broke? How to spend money wise. How to get a straight A. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think Google can really help you with any of these, you know? Why are anime guys attractive? I don't really know if Google is gonna help you. How to get someone to like you. Um, Yo, like you just be Googling anything, man. <laughs> they just Google anything. Any thought they have, they're like, all right, bro. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna Google it. See, the reason this is so foreign to me is because I don't do this. Like, I don't like I don't Google stuff unless I know it's like a factual thing I can get an answer for. But if it's some wiki how, like how to feel better about yourself. Step one, gaslight yourself. Like, I just can't do it. You know, it just doesn't work for me. I can't it just I just I read it and I'm like, damn, this is a waste of fucking time. You know, I don't know. I like to, you know, try to figure stuff out. That's why, but I think it's funny that this person's like, all right, why am I broke? Okay, how do I get someone to like me? Okay, why are anime guys attractive? Just like any thought they have that they need an answer to, they just Google it. How to spend money wise. Why are they attractive? It's such a good question. Uh, I don't know. I've never been like attracted to like an animated character before. I've been like, damn, if this person was real, that would be lit. But like, that's kind of it. But like, damn, I wish this person was a real person so I could be their friend. But like, that's kind of the extent of it. I'm like, where do I find people similar to this? You know? Don't be living, be lying in our faces. No, I'm so serious. That's why I don't understand like when other people have this these feelings because like i've never had them so i'm always like in my head like trying to understand but i just am like unable to fully compute you know stop guys on you i'm not listen if i found anime characters attractive i would be like oh yes i can be like oh damn this character is pretty but like i don't I, I, in real life i wouldn't or i'm not like actually like fawning over the character i'm just like i know design wise they are a pretty character you know He's just realistic and has no game, so that's why he whines about being single. Word. But yeah, I'm literally just like, well, they're not real, so Lamau. Why am I broke is such a good, <laughs> such a valid search, though. All right, another one. Free Minger memes under water, underwater. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it is. Water underwater is the funniest search result ever, bro. Homie searched water underwater. What you mean by that? Water underwater. Water is water underwater or what 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 like what do you mean? Water underwater like what like what? Isn't underwater already water? Like, why are you... Why? What, what is this water inception bullshit? You like, oh, there's water underneath the water? Like, wait, wait. Huh? Underwater caves? But they didn't search underwater caves. You know? Also, uh, water underwater isn't water underwater. It's air pockets underwater. Underwater caves are air pockets underwater, not the reverse. It's not water pockets underwater. It's air pockets underwater. 
Because the same water that connects to the air is the fucking water that connects to the body of water. So, realistically, it still doesn't make sense. That's why I'm like, bro. Water underwater. They wanted the special water at the bottom for more flavor. I think they're talking about walking over water. That's just a funny search. I don't know why. Water underwater. Do, 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 do. Okay, then there's Canavan disease, Teams Pinterest, Leukeo dystrophies, Rett syndrome, tibial plateau, spinal cord compression, CT and MRI difference. DGEN store and multiple sclerosis MRI. My God, y'all speaking my language. That's crazy. <laughs> okay. Um, are you a med student? Cause these aren't like related. Well, I mean some of them are, but well, wait. Actually, most of these are related. Okay. You either are a med student or you have a spine problem. Rhyme pools are probably what they meant. Okay, guys, I know, but I think Googling water underwater is just funny. Regardless, you know? Or they're a med student with a spine problem. True. Um, but thanks, Hater for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, but I, I know they, they could have meant something like that, but I just think Googling water underwater is just funny. Shrimp posture from studying so much. Damn, bro. What you got against med students, huh, Plum? Yo, if you're a med student, Plum just called you a shrimp, bro. Me personally... Guys, me personally, I would not, I, I wouldn't take that, me personally. Just, just saying, you know, just knowing how I am. All right, next one. Red and white flag, 7 p.m. Netherlands, Australia. Um, Raggy, where are my resticles? What the fuck? I have to get a cat to shut up. 3 p.m. PST. Love how, like, in between all this random shit, they're just like, Yo, how do I get this fucking cat to shut up? How do I get this cat to shut up? This fucking, this fucking meowing bitch right here won't shut the fuck up. How do I get it to shut up? And they just, like, were angrily typing on Google, How to get cat to shut up. <laughs> Yo, cats aren't even that loud. Cats aren't even that loud. You want to know what's, what sucks trying to get to shut up? A dog that fucking barks all the time. Oh my God, bro. You think a cat is annoying? Dogs do not. That The dogs that bark all the time are 30 times worse because that shit pierces your ears, bro. Like, cats, they can be loud. Dogs, that's a different type of loud, okay? Like, they like, they use like their whole esophagus and everything or those little ass dogs that have like those ear piercing fucking barks that are like super high pitched like chihuahuas i could never have a dog like that oh my god i low-key think like i don't i think i would put i think i would have to give the dog to a friend or something like 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 give it away i could not do it the amount of of head pain i would be in from those loud ass ear piercing barks is crazy is crazy got their whole diaphragm out yeah my dog may realize i'm not a dog person i'm fine with dogs if they bark occasionally if they're like chill but like some dogs are just like not chill and little tiny dogs are like even less chill i don't know what it is but like the tinier the dog the less chill it is the bigger the dog the more chill it is but also the more potential for it to be like mad aggressive it's like one or the other you know But like training your dog to not bark is probably one of the hardest things to do. 
Like, it's easier to train them not to bite and not to jump up than not to bark. Like, not to bark is very difficult to train. You know? Would you get a teacup dog? I'd be scared to get a teacup dog. And because I'd be scared, I'd step on it and kill it. I'm so serious. Like, I actually think if I got a teacup dog, there's a part of me that's, like, scared that I would, like, accidentally step on it. And it would die. Same with, like, tiny cats or anything like that. Like, if it's within step on range, like, I'm not getting it. I'm not killing the, the thing. You know? Birds over dogs, their screams are beautiful. Nah, birds are annoying as shit. I ain't gonna lie. If there's a pet that I would find the most annoying, it's a fucking... It's like those birds because they just... They just fucking, like, make noises all goddamn day. Birds do not shut the fuck up. Birds will not shut the fuck up. They never shut the fuck up. Birds are, like, the loud, one of the loudest pets you could get, to be honest. And you can be like, my pet bird is super quiet. Listen, bro. Birds do not shut the fuck up, okay? The only type of birds I would want as a pet were the ones that can, like, copy what you say just because I think it would be so fucking funny. Like, imagine a bird that's just like, that's crazy. Or like, shut up, stupid. Or like, you know, like, fuck you, bitch. You know, like, I don't know. That'd be funny. Crazy, crazy. That's crazy. Like, that shit would be funny. It would be annoying as shit, but it would be fun. It'd be funny for like a day. It'd be funny for like a day, a week, you know? But after that, I'd be like, damn, bro, please shut the fuck up. Like, please shut up. I think my, I think my, if I had a parrot, it would, it would tell other people to shut up because of how often I would tell it to shut up. I'd be like, shut up. And then he'd be like, and then he'd just be running, like, shut the fuck up to like random people that walked by, you know? And then like, I'd have problems. Because then my bird would have beef with all my guests. But realistically, it would just be because I would tell the bird to shut up all the time. Anyways, birds are annoying. And then I was like, oh my god, maybe sugar gliders. Sugar gliders have projectile pee. What else? Cats are like fucking like... Yo, cats are like, you know, they're very like bipolar with their emotions. Like, they're very like cool one minute. And then they're like, I'm going to bite your fucking finger off the next... Dogs are more of like a, 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 a average between the two cat emotions or like they just sway to one permanently. Um, What else? You want to know what the chillest pets you can get are, bro? Fish. Fish. Fish are pretty chill. For the most part. I know you can get some exotic fish that cause issues and are loud and shit. But no, most fish. The chillest pets most fish my fish keep dying damn bro fish can be loud ah! some or frogs frogs are kind of chill too depends on what frogs though there's some frogs that are loud as shit bro like like I don't know if y'all know about pac-man frogs Pac-Man frogs are the loudest motherfuckers. The loudest motherfuckers. Same with turtles, too. Sometimes turtles can be loud. But no, no, no. Pac-Man frogs are different. They're like, ah! Like, or they're like, ah! Like, that's literally what they do. Like, their cry is like a fucking engine starting. It's like, ah! Like, I swear to God. Look up a Pac-Man frog. That's what the fuck they sound like. They're like, ah, it's so fucking like, I'm like, bro, shut up. Those motherfuckers are some loud shits. They're loud. They're fucking loud. Turtles can be loud too if they're like the screamy type. Most of the time, frog, frogs are chill. But if you get ones that are like the loud ones or the ribbity ones, hmm. The thing about having frogs, though, is like you have to have live crickets sometimes. 
So, like, then you're going to hear, like, crickets chirping all night. But low-key, I don't think crickets chirping is that bad. Like, it's kind of like a night. It's like, you know, it's kind of like a nice, peaceful aura to an extent. It's like a, it's like a, when you're outside at night. So, it's not terrible. You know? And I would never get a pet tarantula because I'd be scared that bitch would get out the cage and then just fucking kill me. Or some shit. You know? Same with snakes. I'm not waking up with you rapping your fucking, you know, I'm not waking up with you boa constricting my fucking airway and killing me. Uh-uh. Two, uh, thanks for the super chat. Sadly, I got a macaw and a dog and they're annoying. Bro, macaws? Are macaws loud? I don't remember. Aren't they the ones that can talk too? It's showing affection. I do not give a fuck. Okay, my as my snake wraps its shit around my neck. I'm gonna assume it's it's trying to kill me, and so you know, therefore, like, I'm gonna kill it and retire. Like, see, that's why I can't have a snake. You know, I'm aware. Damn, Pac-Man frogs are loud. I told you, bro. They're fucking loud. Like, I don't know what it is with those motherfuckers. They're chill as fuck, but then when they're not chill, they're so loud. Like, I wanted a Pac-Man frog, but then the, the dude at the fucking pet store was like, nah, fam, these are loud as shit. And then he, like, showed me, like, this one frog that would not shut the fuck up in the store. And I was like, damn, I'm good. They either sit there like the little thick ass frogs they are and do nothing or they fucking scream nonstop. Pencil bites are like bee stings. I don't give a fuck. I don't want to experience one. Hello? No. No. Listen, if you like having, you know, would you have a pet bee? Because me personally, I'm not having a pet bee either. Mm -mm. No, no. Someone said yes. Okay, you're crazy. All right, anyways, guys, this is the last one. The how to get a cat to shut up. Then we restart. We got through all of them. I can't believe it. Anyways. I'm going to go. I will be streaming on Twitch in like fucking like 10 to 15 minutes. Because I'm going to be playing League with uh every everyone. Or with Shoto. Who else? Nia Chu, Girl DM, and 5up. So there is my Twitch link. I'm going to pin it. The bot posted it. Um, yeah. You want to watch me? I'll be live there like dead ass in 10, 10, 15 minutes. Um, I'm probably going to talk for a bit because we're not starting until like, like we're not starting for another 30 minutes. So I'm going to like chill for like 15 minutes, get like some food and then join back. And then I will go live on the Twitch televisions. But yeah, thank you guys all so much for watching. Um, I will see you guys. What the fuck am I doing tomorrow? I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, playing Lethal Company. Sure. Yeah, I'll see you guys for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. Link Kitty, thanks for 15 months. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Kiariri, thanks for 10 months. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Thank you, guys so much i will see you guys in like 15 minutes if you want to hang out more bye adios 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 if not have a good one misu thanks for the membership as well thank you thank you kiara thanks for the 13 months thank you thank you
do 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 do